Hey, 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 hey. I hope my mic is louder now than it was. I think it's probably clipping. Let me know if my mic is too loud now, guys. <laughs> I had it so low yesterday, I don't know what the hell happened, but everything seems to be reset, seems to be working properly, and it is man mad early. I don't remember the last time I streamed this early. It is crazy early, but <laughs> welcome aboard, guys. Glad to have you in the stream and chat. What you guys just saw on the opening sequence is Orbix. True Earth, Great Britain, North. They have three for Great Britain. We're in the North one now. They'll be releasing the others. I'm not sure when, but I'm looking forward to that, man. As you guys can tell from the opening shot, Orbix delivers again for you X-Plane people who fly X-Plane, who want that ortho, but who don't want to do the work to get said ortho. It's available from Orbix. It is beautiful, as you can tell. And what I wanted to do today was like, should I fly a GA airplane and show off the ortho? I'm like, no, let's fly a uh, airliner on a real leg, by the way. BA does this flight, so don't tell me it's too short. This is a flight done by BA. We're going to go from Inverness down to Edinburgh and back up to Inverness. Short flight, two legs, it's all good. And after that, we'll see if we do some GA flying. I haven't done that in years, but that's what we're doing today, guys. Welcome aboard the stream and chat. Glad to have you here. Appreciate all of you in the house this morning. It is early. It is what it is. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Let us run the track and say what's up to each and every one of you guys here. Thank you so much for being in the stream. Uh, more gas one is here. Monorific quarter block is in the house. Zato Flies is here. What's going on, Zato? Welcome aboard. Wallock is in the house. First officer pilot depth is here. Johnny Mon 211. Jackson is here. What's up, Jackson? I know the weather outside is terrible, but I'm rocking clear skies today because I want to see the ortho. I'm not rocking real world weather because with real world weather, we'll not be able to see anything on the ground. So I just want to get that straight so you guys could know. Flat Alive is here. Matt Burgess is here. Bomb Tech is here. Greg Hill is in the house. P2 Simpiation is here. Amtrak Fan 1987 is now. I will speak up self. Uh, Tyler Aviator 99. Good morning, sir. Big up, man. Top of the morning to you. Uh, welcome. Andy Boyce, of course, is lined up and flying with us today. Big up, self. VLB Fishing. Good morning, my friend. It's rainy day in the DMV. Oh, man. Welcome, board. Welcome. HD Sim, the man, the myth, the brethren is in the house. Big up, self. Uh, welcome, HD Dream Virtual Flight is in the house. Hello, my friend. Welcome. Flat Alive is here. Mamba 204 is in the house. Andre Nerds is here. Yes, yes. Ivan07 is here. Aviator Chill is in the house. What's going on, sir? Welcome aboard. More guest one is here. Owen Tomlinson. It is a rainy day in South Florida, brother. Tell me about it. I'm looking outside. It's dreary since yesterday. Big up, Owen. Good morning, man. Welcome aboard, man. Bass Player 58 is here. Yeah, he had a trans guys in the house. Captain AB is here. Uh, big up, self. Welcome, welcome to the stream and chat. DC Brother is here. Andre Nertz is in the house. What's going on, sir? From each 3 p.m., so it's kind of nice time. Yes, sir. Big up, man. Big up, Andre. Welcome, welcome. Uh, Mike Cock Coleman is in the house. Welcome, Lord. Levy is here. Did a flight from Philly to Montreal today. Awesome, man. Awesome, awesome. Well, that's what we're going to be doing today, guys. We're just going to be making a flight all the way down. Short flight. About 19,000 feet is a top altitude. And then we're going to bring this bad boy back up here, and we can check out the... Orbix to Earth, which I've been dying for. We'll talk more about it and some good news for the previous people who owned the sim, who owned the Orbix. Um, yeah, good to go. But anyway, we're flying the Tonus A319 on this short leg today with the IAE engines. That's it we're going to be doing today. Depth up self, man. Angelus Blanco, good morning from the Dominican Republic. DR in the house. Welcome, guys. Thank you so much. It's early. <laughs> Let's get to show on the road. Absolutely good to have you guys here in the stream chat. Yes, yes, and yes. Uh, real quick, the scenery here, this airport is n is not part of the Orbix scenery. So if you see the textures looking kind of funky, that's the airport textures. It's not part of Orbix. Just let you know. I think this is a default X-Plane scenery that we're rocking today and all that good stuff. So anyway, without further ado, let's go line up. It's not much of us here. Hopefully we don't get ATC and all that good stuff. Put my graphics up. Put my graphics up to what for us? Uh, up to what? It is what it is. I'm not sure. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go and rock this bad boy here and get the show on the road. Uh, let's go. Big up self, man. It's 3.10 p.m. here, Jackson. I got you. I got you. I got you. What's the real weather like here anyway? Uh, curious to know. Uh, let's go start this bad boy up. Uh, we are on uh, not Unicom yet. Let's go. Battery one can come on. Let's go. Battery two. Let me turn the volume up on this. I did turn it down. Let me know if the volume is going to be too loud on the airplane here. Go here. Available ground power. Hit that switch right there and arm you. And let's go. No smoking sign. 
nav lights can come on crew supply can come on and we're going to go there's nav right left and center is going to be up as she fires up love it love it love it do i need to brighten up these screens something like that perhaps yeah we need to brighten up these screens here all right they're going through their self test and all that good stuff let us do that cool beans and over here as well brighten you up there we go cool and fire this bad boy up good to go nice nice indeed let's get the show on the road man you're rocking real weather it's broken clouds andy should i attempt to see what real weather looks like hmm i don't know we'll, we'll leave it as it is i got a bunch of doors open here uh let's come down here we're gonna do the let me go to what is the um what do you call it the CTAF frequency here anybody know it's gonna tune in CTAF if not it's gonna be 122.8 122.8 what's CTAF if anybody knows let me know let's go to the uh, init page here and uh, we're gonna go flight plan let's go and get our flight plan up there we go flight plan is here EGPE to EGPH so E G P E to E G P H P H here we go cool align the IRS flight number is uh, speedbird 2806 it's good and we can look at cost index and cruise 190 on the altitude cost index is 36 so 36 and 190 that's good all right cool beans so that is going to be our init stuff we'll do um the flight plan here i'm gonna start the apu as well on this rock real weather for the return flight enjoy the senior on the way out okay andy perfect 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 big up self thank you so much we'll do that ctaf is us only oh digital is it ah, interesting didn't know that see i'm learning every day man definitely man tyler john says xp do you have any problems with 320 neo version 2 with the reverse thrust yes it doesn't work tyler there's some kind of work around that you can find but you got to look online for that but it doesn't work out of the box absolutely definitely man Digital Merc, good morning. Welcome aboard. Used to fly the LS Saab 340 out of Inverness as Long Air Logan Air. I got you. Uh, every other chill, yeah, man. FS Expo is going to be good, man. Big up self. I can't hear no plane sounds. Uh, whoever, I can only hear you. Uh, let me turn this volume back up because we turned it down yesterday. All right, make sure that's not too loud. And go here. Let me start the APU here. Make sure we can hear plane sounds. Let's go that can come on and we wait for the flap open then we're gonna start our boarding uh, let's go ahead and start the boarding now why not if you hear passengers let me know you hear passengers there we go you guys should be able to hear that wait for the flap open sorry about that. I'm on 22.8 and Inverness uh, traffic radio check Uh, 2.8 is a hassle bus. What's going on? So, Arnie, love the time. It's like you are in Europe with us. Yes, I am. Thank you, Jackson. Appreciate it, sir. All right, let's go ahead and start the APU here, and then we'll start our boarding. Fire that bad boy up. Doing runway five. Uh, what did we get? Um, what did we get for this? Two three is what we're using. But I think we probably have to do five for takeoff or something like that. We'll double check that at T because if, as far as I know, there is no um, taxi way to these runways. There's one close by. Uh, we'll look at that here in a sec, Captain Carl. Our APU is firing up. Let me just go. Um, Habitat, charts, EGPE, airport, EGPE. And I think our runway out of here um, should be five. I think you are right. Airport info. Because there's no taxi. Yeah, so land on two, three, and take off on five. Because there's no way to taxi to the end of this runway. So, yeah, we're going to definitely take off on five. I don't know if that's the way to do it in real life, but that's what's going to be. We'll take off on five. Absolutely. That's good. What is the opera music? Sato, that is the, the BA boarding music, man. Let's go. Absolutely, man. What gate am I at, Oliver? I'm not at a gate. I'm at a stand. I'm not sure what stand number that is. I'm at a stand, man. <laughs> That's to be. All right. 
let us go ahead and put in our flight plan stuff. Uh, let's go to you. And there it is. So, EGPH. Departure. We're going to runway 05. And no sit out of here. We're going to insert that. And then that will take us to... Gussie. G-U-S-S-I. Gussie, that's going to be 200 and, uh, I'm sorry, 20 miles away. Probably going to go direct Gussie. November 560 is what we're looking at. Airways, November 560. And that takes us into Inbas. I-N-E-A-S. Inbas, good. Insert. And then from Inbass directly to FOIL, F O Y L E. Where is FOIL? E F O Y L E, FOIL. And then from FOIL directly to Grice, G R I C E. That's good. That's going to be 81 miles away. We're going to like really close. <laughs> and that's going to be the Patig 1 Golf. ETH one gulp and two four. Interesting. So arrival. Uh, P runway two four for arrival and PTH one gulf. H one gulf. There we go. It's gonna be arrival. And that's gonna be out of uh, TLA or Novaya. Let me go Novaya on that. Could be wrong. We'll correct it. And that's it. Insert flight plan. We'll check that once the IRS aligns. And we're good to go. Alright, cool. So that is up. Flight plan is in. Good to go. Absolutely, man. <laughs> that is all good, brother. Big up, sir. Alright, cool. Cool, cool, cool. APU should be available. What is the temperature outside, anyway? It is uh, 15 degrees. Not too bad. Back door, front door is open. APU is rocking there. Turn on plane volume some here. Seems kind of low for me. All right, boarding time. Let's get the weight and balance and all that good stuff up in here, and let's get going. Let's come down to you and start looking at stuff. So, 111 passengers need to come on, and cargo is going to be 6.1. So, we're going to go 111 passengers. So, 111. 111, 6.1. There we go. Gonna load the packs. Cargo is gonna be 6.1. And then we'll do fuel back. So that's gonna be 3.0. So 3,000. 3,000. That's it. As much cargo as we're gonna do on there. No. Three. Still not used to these number here. Come on, there we go. 3,000. All right, that's good. We're going to load that. Let's go back to the fuel. How much fuel do we need? Good morning, Aviation Guy 809, dropping the dollar bomb in chat. Aviation Guy, what's up, brother? Welcome aboard, man. Glad to have you in the stream and chat, sir. Appreciate it. Appreciate it, sir. 9.8 on the fuel. 0.8. And 9.8. Go ahead and do a quick refuel. Good to go. Uh, refuel is going to be coming up. Big up, aviation guy. Welcome aboard, man. Good morning, sir. Glad to have you aboard the stream and chat. Appreciate you hanging out with us. We should get the fuel truck coming up here shortly. There comes the fuel truck right under the the the, uh, the catering. Let's get rid of the catering. Catering can go. Absolutely. Let's get rid of that catering, and that catering can go in the meantime. While fuel truck do fuel truck things. There she goes. Awesome. Good to go. <clears throat> yes, yes. And there goes the doors and the catering. That's good. Shout out the ground handling plugin for that. This is how you know how big the IE engines are. Look at the fuel truck and look at the engine. The IE engines are actually fairly substantial size engines. They're not small. They kind of sort of look small, but they're not. 
That's the fun Hello, part about it. Gentlemen, I would love to welcome you aboard anyway, our flight. Anyway, we're good there. When you find your seat, please be sure to place your GPA larger carry-on items in the explosion. overhead bin. Exactly. Smaller items underneath the seat in front of you. Unless you're in the front row, please place all of your I items in the aligned seat. freshly. If you have any trouble finding a location to carry on Let's items, please let's plan mode constraints. Plan mode constraints. We're going to grab some weather here. And we're basically going to be taking off to the please south here on this one. As a courtesy to other passengers. Please gonna get check that to all the your items are put away so that the aisle is clear and other passengers can miss their way. And we're going to gussy, yay, nerdy, and we're going to delete. In the card and the in front of you. We're going to delete a couple of things from here. With these actions, please let I'm a PTH. I don't think we need PTH in this. We're going to get rid of that. Absolutely. During the boarding process. We have Mr. Abysmal Hub, what's going on, brother? Welcome aboard, man. Have Thank a great day. Thank you. <laughs> Mr. Soren Thorson from Copenhagen. What's going on, sir? Good evening, brother. Welcome aboard. Welcome, welcome, welcome. I'm going to get rid of PTH out of my flight plan. Let's go here. It's good. Good. That should look better. Yep, let's go ahead and insert that. ETH out. That looks kind of sort of better. Oh, my range is wrong. Let's check out this flight plan here one more time. Let's go to flight plan and run through it one more time. North and then head south and go to Grice. Yeah, we're probably going to get rid of Grice too for our arrival in there. I don't know. We'll see. We'll just see how that looks. That arrival looks, yeah. Probably going to get rid of Grice at 250. And yeah, we're going to get rid of Grice. We're going to rebuild this entire thing. Unless ATC comes on and spoil our plan, which I hope not. Let's go clear you. That's good. Uh, that looks better. Insert. There she goes. All right, cool. That is going to be our flight plan. Unless somebody says differently, we're going to be good on that. All right, let's go to arc mode. Good. All right. We're almost ready to go. I had an aircraft stop for my upcoming flight on Delta. I will now be boarding a Delta 321 with the new flight sim class cabin. Oh, nice. Nice aviation guy. Pick up something, man. Nice, nice, nice. What Airbus is this? Uh, this is the Tolis A319. That's a Tolis A319, my friend. That's it, Behemoth. Behemoth, welcome aboard. XP, quick question. Having freeze on final during landing around 10 feet from the ground, wondering if you know any solutions. Is that Microsoft and Aviation? I used to have that. And it turns out my graphics were just a little bit too high. And the minute I turn my graphic settings down, I stop having that issue. So it could be, a, it could have been a graphics thing. Could it be a graphics thing, my friend? That's it. Oh yeah. What's going on with Honeycomb, Rackenzie? We were talking about that behind the scenes, man. I don't know what's going on with Honeycomb on that, brother. It's it's something else. All right, we're still fueling here. We're gonna wait on fuel. We need nine point something. But hopefully Honeycomb can sort itself out, or the, the original founder of Honeycomb can find a way to make everything work, and we're going to be good. So hopefully, man. Oh, Ant Aviation, I don't know. Still also could be loading. Uh, how, what kind of CPU do you have, and what's your settings on that? Uh, here are my settings on, um, on graphics. That's my settings right here. I do get some stutters from time to time, but nothing crazy. Nothing crazy, my friend. That's it. Anyway. All right, there we are. Good to go. Building is coming in. Goodly. Uh, passengers boarding is good. Uh, we're going to come up here to the weight and balance stuff. Make sure that's good. Is there any way to grab the ATIS for EGPG? EG, EG, ATIS. See if that works. All right, so Glasgow International Airport. That's where we are, right? Um, 18 knots. Winds are 270 at 18. 10 mile vis, 3,000 foot ceiling, 1002. 1002 is the altimeter here. Alright, 1002. We good? We good to go. Mr. Oliver Rosick, what's going on, Oliver? Good evening, brother. Welcome aboard, man. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Definitely. Is it Tolis uh, or Fly Factor Airbus Street any better? Uh, Tolis Classy Aviation. Tolis, definitely. Yeah, Oliver, we're doing two legs. We're going we're gonna to fly back up. We want to look at the ground textures on this. That's what we're doing it. All right, so there we go. That is set. That's set. That's it. Um, 
we can go. Actually, we should have gone seatbelt sign afterwards. Where? Jeez. It's taking forever to load the fuel in. Is that real time? We have got ground online. I don't see any DGPH ground is online, Zadok. Okay, good. Yeah. Yeah, uh, ant aviation. Is it happening with all sceneries or just some sceneries, ant? What is it happening with? Is it all or some sceneries? I don't know. It's kind of weird for that to happen with an i9 uh, processor. Kind of sort of weird. So, I don't know, bro. Alright, there it is, goes. I think we can close up the back door and get rid of the uh, steer truck. Steer truck can get out of here as well for the back. That's good. And we'll step in. Alright, back door is closed. That is good. Steer truck is leaving. We're almost ready to go. And get this ticket. Why don't we have uh, you up? Cool. Nice. All right, we got one more door open. We're just waiting for the fuel to be finished, and we'll push back and get the stepping out of here. Let's go, let's go. Let's go explore this ortho scenery, or this true earth in North uh, Great Britain. Let's see what our takeoff is. VA yeah, looks looking nice, though. That is looking good. Love that. All right, one door open. Seatbelt sign is closed. Um going to go you clear clear makeup squall code we didn't get any uh squall code either we are ready to go when you are we are almost ready to go check absolutely almost ready to go all right let me just look at some numbers here uh let's go to the uh in good afternoon ladies and gentlemen in and welcome aboard flight 2806 uh, zero Our fuel weight zero fuel weight cg zero minutes. fuel weight is going to be 57 the one Seven, we ask that you make seven, sure that all devices are in airplane mode and your larger devices are now shut down and stowed. If you have not already, please fasten your seatbelt and verify it is low and tight across your Lock map. fuel, how much we ask for fuel? Is it uh, 9.1 on the fuel? Cabin crew secure doors for departure. Let's go. Fuel was going to be uh, 9.8 on the fuel. 9.8. Let's go 9.8. Here we go. And uh, we're going to go to the uh, init page. And I'm sorry, we're going to go to the uh, init B. That's done. Let's go to the perf page here. We're going to run our calculations based on this. 111 passengers, cargo 9.8. And uh, that is good. Let's go and take off perf. Uh, runway 5 is what we're going to be using. Out of here. And uh, winds are calm, basically. 15 degrees, 1013. Dry, any ice off. Total weight, flex, uh, standard. Uh, auto on the config. Let's compute this bad boy. There we go. So, config 2 he wants us to do. Oh, we're doing a config 2 out of here. I've not noticed a lot, but I usually use freeware or payware scene whenever default, so it happens more on payware. So, something is going on with your loading in on... How much RAM do you have, Ant? Could be your RAM. Could be your RAM that's doing it. So, we're doing a config 2. Flex 68. So, up 0.6. 2 slash up 0 0.6. Let's go 2 slash up 0 0.6 on that. Uh, our flex temp is going to be 68 on the flex. Jeez, it's tempting. And then our V speeds are going to be 27, 34, 37. Here we go. All right, sweet deal. All right, we're in like Flynn. Almost ready to go. Uh, no sit out of here. Set this to 5,000. That's fine. And uh, where's our fuel? 9.78. Almost done with the fuel truck there. Fuel truck should be leaving here shortly. It is gone. Ladies and gents, good to go. Awesome. I'm at Inverness. I'm sorry, Jackson. I'm at Inverness. Yeah, so 32 gigabytes of RAM should be good anti-aviation, so I'm not entirely sure what's going on with your system there why you'll have the freezing it's interesting all right let's go home and let's go airport charts all right so we're going to push back nose to the left we're taking off runway five all right so we got one door open let's go ahead and close up that door and we're going to call for our better pushback here toby where are you and do 
Plug in. Better push back. Sorry to push back. Ground to cockpit. Please show me where you want to go. We want to go there. Cool. Ground to cockpit. Toe is driving right, up. Toe's driving up, so let's close up the door. Closed and closed. That's good. Make sure chocks are off. External power can go. That's good. Shocks can go as well. That's good. Let's go TARA. Start the block time clock over here. It's going to be a very short flight. Seatbelt sign is on. Beacon signs can come on. That's good here. And here comes the tug for us. And uh, yeah, we're going to push back and get out of here. Not bad indeed. And get rid of the gate, the jet bridge, and all that good stuff can go. Gate should be leaving here. Supervisor van is leaving. And uh, we are good. Let's push. Flying from Glasgow to uh, okay. Hammermet in Tunisia. Ready to Thomas connect. Cook, 320. Oliver, nice, bro. Nice, Oliver. Thank you, brother. Appreciate it. All right, cool. That is good. Good to go. There we go. Should be pushing back shortly. Let's go now. Can we go down to Southampton at some point from Inverness? Yes, Jackson. We can. Uh, when uh, the next Orbix drop to Earth, we could do something like that. Absolutely. Let's see why not. Raise the nose. So connected and bypass pin inserted. Release parking brake. Right. Parking brake release. pushback and you may start engines all right here's our pushback let's go let's go let's go watch it baggage guy don't be driving behind my airplane there he goes all right cool let's go start mode cool pressure is good on both sides let's go start engine number one on you and n2 rotation Ladies and gentlemen, please direct your attention go. to the screen for an important safety demonstration. And in this traffic, uh, Bieber, Okay, so you're here to audition traffic. for a part in the British Airways Let's safety go. information video. Can you just look into the camera and give your name, please? Hi. Playing Microsoft all the time, explain to her really doesn't look too bad at all. Ah, uh, Tom, it has its moments and it's just getting better, Tom. Well, this could That's be a good thing about it. Game, mate, so don't mess it up. Shall we get one of the cameras? moments. Now listen to Adele, there's going to be an auto queue, so you don't have to learn the lines. You just read them. Let me turn down okay, the... Focus. Mm. Okay, focus. Okay, action! Hello. You will now demonstrate the Here we go. Not bad, not bad. I have a maintenance issue. Do you, Andy? <laughs> what did you break, man? Oh, the tug sounds are awesome, man. Yes, they are. The tug sounds are awesome. Good. Alright, it's doing its thing here. I love the heat shimmer. The heat shimmer to me is one of those things that seems so good at this end. Operation complete. Set parking brake. Didn't know Gordon Ramsay what? Parking brake can go on. Disconnecting close. Stand by. Uh, on. That's good. Alright, so that's one good engine there. Let's go ahead and set the second engine can start. Bearing in mind this may be behind you. Well, here you go, starting up. Good to go. I'm not seriously that big about the nearest exits. Hold on a second guys, here's a FedEx guy at my door. Alright, this might be too loud now, let me know. Oh, that sounds good. Wow. Alright, cool beans. Second engine coming up. Good to go. Oh, 
we got two um, light jets out here too. As well. Look at that. It's probably Zara. All right, good to go. That's good engine one, good engine two. Trout guy is there. Fuel guy is there. We're good there. Awesome. All right, let's go flat two. One, two. That's good there. And let's also go to... Hold on a second. Uh, what was our takeoff perf? Uh, takeoff perf was... Up to zero point six. So let's go to normal mode. It's good. Let's go up zero point six after the flight control check. So flight controls. Right side is good. Nose up. Left side is good. Nose down. Right. Left. And up zero point six. Five and six. Here we go. All right, cool. We are good to go. Okay, so Jim, I'll read the line, and then when I do the oh yeah, let's look at that. Okay. Some okay. detail under here. Please now ensure that your seat right. is upright good. and in a take off position with armrest down. <laughs> yes, that are you what flying the John Denver nights? Nice. Sorry, headphone down. users, my bad. Mr. Lanzan, yeah, welcome aboard. Welcome, welcome, welcome. You flying to Inverness in real time next week? Genius. Nice, oh, nice. Bring up, sir, brother. So then just all right, so um, let's go. Everything is good. Turn off the APU. Master, taxi light. That's good. Flight control check is good. And we don't need any um, nose boost steering and all that good stuff. And inverse traffic. Speedbird, 2806, uh, taxiway Alpha, Alpha 1 to runway 05 traffic. If you have any questions, please ask your captain. Great, very intense. I love the sound base. Maybe we could try armor speed brakes. Auto brake to the max here. And turn off the You got it, yeah, exactly. So we can see the beautiful smile. Very rare. But it's not X files. We just need a config check on you. Brilliant, thank you, Jillian. Config is good. Action. Engine temperature and predictive wind shear. There we go. So if you've got any All right, let's go. Roll them out. Any currency, She's rolling. It, take it out, now, this airport you're looking at is not Orbix. That's a freeware airport. That's why it looks so... The graphic looks like that. Once you get her airborne, you'll see the Orbix scenery around here. Is it using real-world photogrammetry? Audi, yes. I think it is. I think it is. Good morning, Mr. VKW1242. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Ask one of your gorgeous cabin crew members. Have a enjoyable flight. This announcement. <laughs> Yo, this BA announcement is crazy. Absolutely nuts. Here goes a Ryanair. Ryanair's taken off. Did my red stripe make it on board the aviation guy and I? You know it did. You know it did, sir. Traffic, speedbird, 2806, holding short, runway 5, grab it. Gotta wait until the engine warm up here. We got oil temperatures low. Not quite ready yet. Um, engine number 2, oil temps at 45. Should I rev it up to make it warm up quicker? Or should I leave it alone and give it some time? I don't know. Joe Sarda, big up self, man. Welcome aboard, brother. Welcome, welcome, welcome. We got Beethoven on board, I know. That's it. All right, so we're going to take off uh, to the north, and we're going to make a right turn and head direct to our first waypoint. That's going to be the plan for takeoff here, which is going to be directly to Gussie, I want to say, or Nedsey. Direct Gussie or direct Nedsey. All right. All temperature, what are you doing? Let's go. There we go. All right, we're good. Let's do cabin secure check. Independence traffic, Speedbird 2806, uh, lining up runway 05 traffic. All right, strobe's on, beacon's on, runway turnoff's on, all the lights are on. Let's go ahead and start the clock. Doesn't even matter. It's going to be a short flight out. One back. Let's go line them up. Let's go, let's go. Just reinstalled X-Plane yesterday. After months of Microsoft, flight, first flight will be the tallest 340. Ooh, good plane. Uh, Mr. Con Carnage, welcome aboard, man. 
to rev up the engines to warm it up. Do it. Break the engine like that. It's got to warm up naturally. That's it. Cablab says, XP, I enjoyed the live stream yesterday. Looking forward to shaking your hand in Vegas. Yeah, Cablab, man. Come up and say hi, brother. Come up and say hi to us. Thank you, thank you, bro. I think I'll lose my mind if I was on board a BA flight. <laughs> put on your headsets, man. Put on your headset. Put on um, noise cancelling. And you're going to be good to go. All right. Here we go. Let's hold short here. We need as much runway as possible. Are we config 2? Yes, we are. Config 2 is good. All right, you guys ready? Infamous traffic. Cooper. Maybe let's take the takeoff on the zero five. There we go, Manflex! 68. Your speed's alive, nose down. 80 knots. 100. Neutral. 120. Stopping now to rotate. There she goes. All the runway. Yes, yes. Got a positive rate of climb. Let's go here. Let's watch the flyby. Ladies and gentlemen, look at that. Yep. Oh, oh, oh. Wow. All right, good to go. Now, there's Orbix True Earth, guys. There's the Orbix scenery I'm talking about. Let's get it ready from that. Oh, look at that. Wow, wow, wow. Just look at that. What I'm talking about. That is brilliant. Beautiful. Imagine having the entire Earth look like this from Orbix. That's what I want. Let's go level climb. We're going to start our right turn here. That's beautiful. Shout out to Orbix. Let's go flap one. That's good. That's what I'm talking about. Look at that scenery, man. Holy moly. Wow. I think I'm going to go autopilot on this. Let's go autopilot here. Let autopilot take it. Let's go. And let's go direct to... What's the next waypoint? Direct to where? Because I want to look at the scenery out here. Direct to Gussie. Insert. Direct Gussie. The airplane's got this. Let's go. S speed. Flaps coming in. But what I want to focus on is the scenery, though. Look at that scenery. Hand me that doesn't look good. Oh my word. Look at that. Come on, man. Orbix, what did you do? And the funny thing is, it is so light on frames. That's the funny part about it. It is so light on frames. No problem with frames at all showcasing this. I didn't see any difference at all with the frames. All right, here we go. We're going to keep this going up to 12,000 for now and then 19 final. There it is. Let's go outside. Rip ears. Let me turn the volume down outside. Not bad, guys. Turn that down outside. But yeah, look at the scenery. Look at that. That's beautiful. Pre placement arc is correct, coloring is correct. It does work with wind pair and icing, but this is what you got to look forward to when they release uh, Great Britain Central, Great Britain South, uh, Florida, Seattle, and all the other places that they have. That's what you're going to be looking at on Orbix. That is ridiculously nice. That is good. And no stutters. No stutters. Absolutely no stutters. Let's go to standard mode here. There she is. Standard is up. Uh, disarm the speed brakes. That's good. Uh, let's go ahead and turn you guys off. Good to go. Strobes off. Beacons on. That's off. That's good. 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 Seatbelt signs on. And that's the only thing though. Flying up this far north, the sound is the sun is low in the sky. That's it, man. Melvin, what's going on, sir? Welcome aboard, man. Bigger J is here. What's up, man? Long time no see, man. Hope all is well. Bigger J, hope all is well with you, brother. Thank you so much for asking, man. I appreciate it, Bigger J. Pick up yourself. Oh, we need to do a, a wing view on this side over here. Give me a sec, guys. Wing view inbound. 
we gotta do a wing view over here. Almost forgot. Let's go across the aisle and go see what's going on. Hello, Mr. Wall Kenny. Yeah, man. Whenever I can do early streams, it's it's the best, brother. It is the best. Long haul to Zurich. Doug Ridge. Yes. All right, cool. Let's go you, and that's gonna be our wing view out the back here. Here she goes. Save you. Awesome. But yeah, scenery for the win. Come on, Orbix. You need to get this stuff out. Gentlemen, we have now passed you may turn on larger portable and there's a hint. Love this the hazing effect. Reminder. This looks good. Chief Sim Pilot, that's what's up, brother? Welcome aboard, man. Welcome, 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 Chief. Glad to have you aboard. Our uh, Jackson is 7,000 for standard. Not bad. Let's go to 19 here. 19,000 is what we're going to go up to. And let's go ahead and um, do the obligatory flyby. Rip ears. Nice. Good deal. Uh, we'll rock real weather on the way back just to see what it looks like in real weather. We'll rock real weather. But yeah, loving it. Shout out to Orbix. So yeah, if you fly airliners, it does work for you guys as well. You don't have to be flying GA alone just to get to, to Earth. Uh, Great Britain, or any one of the true art series. Airliner flying, it looks pretty good. I love the tree placement down there. That is just absolutely gorgeous. Where is it flying through? What is that? Like valley with a river down there. It's interesting. Definitely. Gotcha. There's a river down there. We're like flying through a river in a valley. Is that windmills? Yeah, it is windmills, guys. There is windmills in the scenery. Look at that. And all these things are hand placed, by the way. All of these things are hand placed. They are, they are definitely hand, hand, hand placed uh, windmills and stuff. Buy it. All right, there we go. Haze looks good. Love that. All right, we're at 14, going up to 19. That's top of climb. We've got a short cruise of about, uh, what, 15, 20 miles, and we're going to start our descent. We'll see what the landing looks like coming in. We'll rock the replay on that. <laughs> Zaddy, you've reached cruise already? Of course. You're flying a rocket ship with that Denver jet, bro. All right, I'm going to go seatbelt signs off for now. Seatbelt signs can't come off just because these people are not going to have enough time. Measurement from the flight deck. Captain speaking. I've turned off the past seatbelt sign for now. Um, it's going to be a very short cruise. I'm going to start up since I need to use the bathroom. Now will be the time to do so. Uh, welcome aboard Speedbird. We should be on the ground in about uh, another 15, 20 minutes. Thank you. You guys have a lot of windmills around. A lot, a lot. So, what do you guys think? What do you guys think about Orbix to Earth? I need your honest opinion on this from what you're seeing here. So, this is for the guys who are. You don't want to spend hours and hours and hours of downloading ortho you could just get this instead and this works actually better than ortho because you don't have to clean up tiles and so forth yeah, i mean good news for the guys who are in x-plane 11 you get a 90 percent discount off of this so you're literally going to pay like four bucks or something or five bucks for this don't quote me on it it's crazy how little you're going to pay to get it the upgraded version of 12. So you get a 90% discount off of whatever you paid or whatever the price is for the scenery. It is it is good. So if you're on 11 and you bought this already, you'd be good on 12, man. Can you get Orbix as a monthly subscri subscription or do you need to purchase every release separately? Yeah, uh, Mr. Concierge, I pay about... Oh, Orbix? Which Orbix? What are we talking about? Orbix what as a subscription? Uh, Mr. Uh, Concarnage. It's like the flight from Heathrow to Manchester, you, your own jet cruise about 15 minutes. Yeah, man. Oliver Rossick says, damn, I was away for five minutes away and my PC and my autopilot decided to go poof and made me nosedive. Oh, jeez. Sorry, Oliver. Uh, Ice Mentality, this is the Tolis A319, my friend. Tolis A319 is what we're rocking today. That's it. The problem is that you can't have both Orbix and Ortho at the same time. Yes, you can, Ali. Just remove your ortho. And that's what I did. I have I have ortho for this area. I just removed what two tiles? 
Of course so. After service orders flight, we will not be able to offer in flight service. Please let us know if there's anything we can do to make your flight more enjoyable and we will yeah. assist you. I you do, uh, Ali. I ha I'm removed two tiles and, and substituted for the um for the Great Britain. So yeah. I'm using a combination of ortho in those areas and then uh, true earth in other areas. So you can use both. So that's no problem. Yeah, Ali. That's what I have, man. All right, Zato, give me a give me a few. Let me just concentrate on this scenery here. Take a look, man. Oh, the scenery from Ormix, Mr. Concarn, it, it just buy it one time, you own it forever. There's no there is no um, subscription fee to pay here. You just buy the scenery one time, download it, you own it forever. Yeah, that's it. It's it's not a subscription at all. You just buy it and you own it. That's it, man. Buy it and you own it. You're good to go. What about Ortho Ortho Alley? Uh, good question. I don't know. They're looking for that. See, because I own my own Ortho, I just remove the, the selected tiles that this area covered, and then this covers that area for me. What's up, Pilot Depp? Yes, yes. Welcome aboard, sir. Looking good, looking good. Love that. Are you using Visual XP for x 12? No, uh, County MC. That's just no Visual XP. All right, top of descent is coming up. We're gonna bring this down to uh, 10,000 here and plan our, our arrival. Let's go to the init page, uh, next page. What's the destination data? Oh, perf. Next phase, next phase, and we'll go start our descent there. All right, let's go ahead and push. That can come on. Diva Sun is on. Uh, weather data on the arrival. Landing curve. Runway 24. We're 010 at 0 knot, 15 degrees, 1014. All right. We start our descent already. Uh, let's go 15 degrees. It's good. And um, we'll check the altitude here in a second as we start our descent. Our transition is 15, so we're going to compute the landing. Um, VAP is 138. Um, status overweight, really? Yeah, overweight landing. Oh, how so? We took on too much fuel. Full flaps on landing, uh, air condition on, uh, auto brakes to low, reverse, good to go. Let's do auto brake to low. That's fine. Destination data is in. Just got to do our charts here as we bring her down. All right, we're on our way down. Let's go look at that. Look at charts. Shakovic, that is my the FPS starter. You see, that's my 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 computer. My computer. That's it. Now we're back at 50 FPS. That was just my computer. All right, let's go ahead and go. EG what? We're doing EG EG PH on this. EG PH. EG PH. Uh, look at the airport and the arrival and the runway. Airport. We're landing on 24, which is out and back. Get off on the, the left hand side. And the arrival was the what again? What was the arrival? The arrival was the. Do, 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 the PTH1 Golf. Runway 24. What the heck is this? PTH1 Golf, a runway 24. All right, there we go. We're going to go back to PTH on this or something like that. And uh, runway 24, arrival. Runway is approach. ILS DME 24. That's good. And we're just going to look at our minimums here. Minimums is going to be uh, 300. That's all I need. All right, cool. All right, we're set. 
ladies and gents, as we take our way down. Let's go, see what it looks like. <clears throat> the plane's overweight, you are gonna collapse the gear. Zato, um, I don't know how to burn off fuel. Why would it give me so much fuel for a short flight? So, we're gonna have to take our chances. Uh, the brakes are gonna be hot. So, if, uh, what did it say? Did it give us the brakes low? Let's go medium brakes on this. It's gonna just have a hot brakes, that's it. There's our profile. And we're in profile, we're at speed, that's good. Bring us down to about 3,000. Seatbelt sign is on. Uh, let's do our obligatory uh, flyby. Look at that scenery, man. Scenery is good. Not bad, not bad. Yeah, we're gonna be fine. And you loaded pounds in the aircraft? Oh, you know what? Yeah, I think I did my flight plan. Holy crap. I think I did my flight plan in pounds that we should have had. Um... Oops. Yep, that's why. That's what it is. That's exactly what it is. All right. EGPH. EGPE. That's what it was. Well, we're gonna have hot brakes or broken landing gear. One of the, <laughs> one of those things. Uh, what do we want this in? I'm doing the return leg setup right now. Make sure we're in the right uh, pounds, kilos, generated. You called it, man. You called it, brother. That's what I did. That's explained the overweight. Yeah, genteel. Winsburg, what's going on, sir? Welcome aboard, man. Welcome, welcome. Do some dumping on the way down. You can't dump on the A319. As far as I know. Look at that. Look at that, man. Have you will have all-in-one stressed gear, fuselage, and brakes. To Towards the XP is still time. burning off fuel over the Scottish Highlands. <laughs> but wow. The detail in, in the true earth is just is just phenomenal, man. <laughs> Mr. Con Carnage, thanks for the Junior Wings membership, brother. Big up yourself. Welcome aboard, man. Enjoy your custom emojis. Thank you so much for your support, Mr. Carnage. I absolutely appreciate it. Welcome, 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 sir. Glad to have you here. Somebody says um, ground is on, 121.755. 21. 7.5. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Alright, good to go. Right, let's go, speed brakes. Alright, speed brakes is good. Above 7,000 there. We're good on you. Speed brakes coming out. That will handle our descent. Good to go. Thank you, Mr. Tystone. These views are nice, sir. These are nice, man. Our 30-minute flight of passengers worried. Yes, they are. I can imagine. They are worried, man. I've always watched you to be fair, so I thought I'd get a membership. You are always inform informative. Answer the chat. Keep you on. Yo, big up Mr. Con Carnage, man. Blessings, brother. Thank you so much for the support. Appreciate it, man. Zada, you just passed me? What the hell are you flying? Some kind of rocket ship? Riding along in my automobile My baby beside me at the wheel No particular place to go. We're just literally making up our own arrival here. So we're gonna go downwind. So we're gonna do a vectored arrival. That's what we're gonna do on this. We're gonna be fine. Right, speed brakes come back in. Yeah, we're gonna do a vectored arrival. Yo, the colors, man. The way they got the colors in the um, True Earth Ortho is just absolutely fabulous. I'm not sure if you guys saw the screenshot I put on Instagram and um, and uh, X, but this is exactly what it is. Look at that. And what I like is that you can mask the road so you don't see the road stick out like typically what x plane roads look like. You can mask those and you see the ones in the Ortho. And it's phenomenal. Phenomenal, I should say. Ooh. 
Rock. Uh, it's awesome. That color is awesome. All right, there we go. Bring her down. Yes, yes. Airport is going to be off to her right over here somewhere. That's going to be our field. And we're going to go downwind and back, come over over the water. Zato is off there, 2,000 feet. We're going to hold that seven here. We're going to go down. We're going to pick up our ILS at 3,000. Edinburgh. It's not borough. It's Edinburgh ground. Yeah. Looking good. Question, guys. I am actually tempted. Still need to be on Unicom? No problem. I'm actually tempted to take out a Cessna and fly the next leg and do a tour of Edinburgh. Or should I continue with the jet and fly back up? to Inverness. What do you guys think? Oh, look at that. Come on, man. Look at that. Should I should I do uh, a, a GA and fly around um, Edinburgh, or should I take the plane back up? What do you guys think? You want to take a Comanche out for a spin? Yes or no? Cessna or, or 319? What do you guys think? Cessna R319, let me know. GA. Yeah, we haven't done a GA in forever. It means I'm going to have to change my uh, equipment real quick. Yeah, we haven't done some GA flying in a while. Put a vote in chat. All right, here we go. Vote. I'll start a poll. Next leg. Next leg is uh, airliner or GA. All right, there we go. That's cool. We'll look at that. All right, cool. And we're gonna go out and back here. We're gonna go heading select. Let's go heading. And then we're gonna go down and then back. Let's go. Looking good. Jeez. All right, Mr. Con Carnage. Hmm. It's time for a change, XP. It's time for me to fly the Learjet. Don't do GA flying well. But let's see. What's up, Ninja Man? Good evening, brother. Welcome aboard. What bridge is this over here? What is that? Ooh, look at that. Bruh. Bruh. That is... Oh, here's our airport. So that's... That's the field. Damn, that always fast. We're gonna go out and back. Uh, so we're about 20 miles there. All right, let's go ahead and do uh, open descent down to 3,000. Gotta watch our speed here. And let's go ahead and go to. Yeah, we're gonna go a little closer and then do it. All right, let's get her down. Jeez, you guys want to see GA? I haven't flown GA in this thing in a minute. Oh, look at that. What football pitch is that, guys? We need to visit that in our thing, in our tour. But this scenery is nice. Shout out, Orbix, again. We need to fly to EGPF XP. You get to see the city of Orbix. Really? How far is it um, um, from here, HD? Let's go downwind here, and then come back and land. Alright, so we're downwind. 
keep the speed up. Getting her down to three. Get her down. There it is. Good to go. Ladies and gentlemen, the one and only CST Gaming is in chat. What's going on, CST? Good evening, brother. Welcome aboard, man. Welcome aboard. How you doing? Glad to have you in the stream and chat. Appreciate it. Appreciate it. So, EGPF. Okay. All right. We're going to have to find that on a map and see. We'll do the built-in map. EGPF. All right. Cool. Alright, so we're downwind. Um, pull the speed brakes out because we're going to start turning a, a base to get there at 3,000. So we're going to go direct to C124 at 3. Let's go LS push button. Can't come on. Go the glass. I think that football stadium is for a team called Hearts. This is Ryan. You got you, Ryan. Let's bring our speed back to uh, 210. There we go. We're going to go flap one here in a second. And go direct. Uh, Q&H is going to be what? 1014 on the Q&H. Activate the approach phase. Confirm. Good on that, and let's start our direct too. There she goes, direct. All right, cool. And we're gonna push you. We're managed. Let's go flap one. Can't come out. It's good to go. Wow, wow, wow! That view is just gorgeous. Absolutely beautiful. Phoenix Block Two is awesome, Danny. Phoenix Block Two is awesome, man. Jeez, man. Look at that. Look at it. And, um, and bro, traffic. Speedbird 2806 turning base uh, runway 24. Traffic. Alright, keep the 3000 there. That's good. Speed is fine. Alright, that is good. Speed brakes can go in. Let's go ahead and arm the speed brakes. That's good. We're approximately 13 out. We're going to make a right turn and pick up. Uh, let's go ahead and arm the approach mode for us. Good to go. Even the, the, the water masking is beautiful. The way the water masking is, is legit nice. I'm loving that. <clears throat> All right. We should be picking up the localizer here shortly, turning final, and make our calls, and then tower is on 18.705, is that, is that it? Tower is up. Alright, we should be good now, picking up. Right turn and localizer. There it is. And capture. Uh, Edinburgh traffic, Speedbird 2806, 12 out, runway 24. Um, 118.705. Oh, 705. Good evening, um, Edinburgh Tower, Speedbird 2806, 11 out, runway 24. Continue approach, uh, 2806. Alright, cool. Alright, we're good there. Localizer captured, speed captured, we're in managed mode, and we're good to go, man. ZSIM pilot, what's up, brother? Good evening, ZSIM. Welcome to the stream and chat, man. Thank you so much. Appreciate it. That's beautiful only if my sim could look like that all the time. Owen, <laughs> it could, man. A little bit of tune in and we should be okay, bro. Should be good. All right, so ground is going to be 121755. 
Alright, there we go. So localized captured, glass up captured, we're good to go, man. That sound. That's the sound of the men working on the chain. Okay, let's go flap two. Start slower down. Uh, we are currently six out. Let's go full gear. We need to slow all the way down. Let's go light. That's good. Good. And there's our runway. We're overweight, but anyway. What's the next round? Oliver, we're gonna fly some GA out of here. My ATC is quiet. I did turn it down the last time. We'll turn it back ATC there. So ATC should be up now. Thank you. Alright, let's go flat full. Flat full. Clear to land, spur wings. I'm sorry, speedbird 2806. Look at that. We're gonna tour here with the GA flying. We got to tour there. We gotta do some tour, some touring. All right, let's go. Let's go. All right, speed's coming back on point. We are overweight. We have medium on that, but we'll see. One thousand. Check. We we'll take it from here in a second. Let's go, man. Yo, Brandon Dammer, it's been a minute, brother. Welcome aboard, man. Welcome aboard, Brandon. Glad to have you in the streaming chat. I appreciate it. Wow, look at the golf course. I mean, I hate to be looking out the window on the final, but that's all Orbix right there. Nicely done, Orbix. Look at that. Good go. Careful. All right, let's go. Let's go take it, my airplane. Boop, boop, boop. Winds calm. Good to go. Short runway too. Three hundred. Got a backward sensor. Two hundred. Landing. All right, we have no room to fill today. One hundred. Let's get fifty over the numbers. 50, 40, 30, 20, retard, retard, 10, 5. Oh, take the butter. We'll take that. <laughs> Reverse deployed. Look at it. We need to smash the gears and break the thrust. Can we get off here? 60. Let's go hard on the brakes. Reverse idle. Reverse is off. No, we can't turn here. That's not a taxiway. Taxiway is going to be the next one. Look at that. Oh, my word. I just love explaining something special about it. Absolutely. Bruh. All right, we got to go left right here. We should be good. Beast it. Yes, yes. Let's get her off. Good to go. Here, here, and here. Awesome. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome. Edinburgh. That was beautiful. Gorgeous. Not a freeware airport. Uh, Tala Aviator, you were supposed to, but I got on before that. I wanted to show the scenery. Man. Wow, 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 wow. Good to go. Alright, nothing there. Start making our left here, and then we should call the guy. Look at the, um, the marks around the, the, the taxiway sign from the lawnmower. Let's go. Let's go, you. And come in. And uh, tower. Speedbird 206 cleared runway to 4. Speedbird 206, welcome to Edinburgh. Hold Alpha 1 2. Hold Alpha 1 2, 2806. Alright. Speedbird 206, contact Edinburgh, ground 121, these will 755 for further. 21755, 2806, thank you. 
Let's go start you. Taxi. Let me turn off. Start. Alright, I don't know what stand we're going to. Alpha and Delta. Alpha Delta 1, via Alpha and Delta Infinity 2. And uh, Speedbird 2806, taxiway Alpha. Speedbird 2806, heading ground to taxi Alpha, hold Alpha 15, expect stand 22. Alpha, hold 15, stand 22, 2806. Alright, cool. Alright, let's go. We gotta hold that 15 here. Stand 2-2. Uh, Let's go ahead and start the clock. Our flight time was... Don't know. Left on 36 minutes flight time. 36 minutes flight time with that. Does scenery change with the weather? Yes, Owen. It does show snow and icing on the, on the scenery. It absolutely does show snow and icing on the scenery. It seriously does. <coughs> This is a freeware scenery, by the way. This is part of X-Men freeware. Yeah, I'm on a mic on over 30 turn on the outsung for information callback. We're going to be going for the one, please. This, the, all these planes are so nice. Absolutely so nice. Thank you, Greg. Appreciate it, man. The approach in realistic physics, just wow, yeah. Click the double and got some one mark. Got some one at Charlie Depart. Alright, APU is available. Lead. Can come up. Good to go. Need to start uh, with Vatsim because I'm all about immersion. Pass the test. I need to understand all the comms. So, Mr. Con Carnage, I have a Vatsim tutorial. If you type exclamation Vatsim in chat, you'll get my tutorial how to get on Vatsim and be successful at it. So, check out my Vatsim tutorial, Mr. Con Carnage. I have one. Check it out. Check out my Vatsim tutorial. It's pretty good. Uh, Alpha Lima Golf to 22 2806. So right on Lima Golf 1022. Alright, so we're going past the Easy Jets and the uh, Ryanairs and the Lufthansa's. We're going to get parked in the back. Right on Golf, stand and, 22. Uh, on, we, uh, oh, and Tomlinson, big up yourself, Regin. I may say, Beagle, Beagle, I love them, I see them. Owen, thank you for the five dollar, my brother. I appreciate it, man. Appreciate it, Owen. Absolutely, bro. Big up yourself, bro. Big up, big up, big up. All right, we're looking for golf. That's Fox. Right now, golf is going to be the next one. We're going to stand to two. Yes. Thank you, thank you, Owen. Appreciate it, man. All right. Golf is the next one, I think. Oh, Lima, then Golf. Lima's the next one. Dude, can you imagine how good my sim is going to look when I upgrade my CPU? Right. There's stand the 2 2 for us. That's what I need, you know. Mr. Sergeant Villain says uh, that was an absolutely insane landing. Big up, uh, Sergeant Vision. We're going to run the replay on that. Then we're going to jump in some GA. Where the heck is Stan 2 2? Alright, it's going to be over here somewhere. We'll see. Thank you, Owen. Appreciate it. Let's see if I can get the Stan numbers from this. Um, airport. Stan info. Parking Stan. Stand 2-2 two two is going to be over here somewhere. Let me just hold it short. Hold on. Let's get this right. Um, that's Golf. Stand 2-2 two two is going to be on our right side. Um, send to here. Okay, I see where we are. All right, cool. So we're going to go up here. Is this airport correct? I think it is. Yeah, something like that. It's probably missing Stand 2-2 two two on this, but it's all good. Yeah, 2-2 two, two should be over here somewhere, but 
I don't think we have it at all. Stand two is gonna be one of these here. It's all good. All good. We will go take something over here. We're gonna be all right. TXR, the planes and trains. Hello, my friend. Welcome aboard TXR. Glad to have you. One of these would be Stan 2-2, so we're just going to go grab one of those. We're going to be good. Laqued, what's up, brother? Good evening, Laqued. Welcome aboard. Let's go off on you. And let's get this in. I love the green stains on the ground. And stop it. Right up on it. There we go. Whoever is standing up, rip you. All right, let's go to park break. Can go on. It's good to go. Let me go outside. I wonder what the engine sounds sound like. Let's go two and one. get the baggage people coming up to the airplane here engines are down let's go ahead and do seatbelt signs no smoking let's go beacon lights and let's go ahead and turn off the TARA stop the block time clock 51 minutes shortest flight I've ever done 51 minutes on the block 36 minutes on the flight seatbelt signs are off and the stairs should be coming up as well to get the passengers off there it is stairs are coming up ladies and gentlemen Welcome, welcome, welcome to Edinburgh. Bruh. Bruh. That was nice. GA is for the winner. All right, GA fly. Oh, wow. That was close. That was close. All right, so we're going to do some GA flying. We haven't done some GA flying in a while. We'll watch a replay on this and do our thing. We'll, we'll, we need to check our... Um, passenger satisfaction, etc., etc., and go do some GA flying. GA flying beats airliner flying today, guys. That's what it is. All right, a couple of things. We need to unplug some stuff to do that, but let's go ahead and look at our landing rate and see what we got. We're still attacked. Ooh, wow. Look at our passenger satisfaction. 96%. At first, it said it says 97%. 96% passenger satisfaction. Andy on a six mile final. We want to catch your landing here, Andy. Hold on a sec. Let me let that do what it's got to do here. Let's go watch Andy land real quick. Um, let's go. Where's our runway? Our runway is here. So Andy should be coming. Andy, we're gonna we're gonna catch your landing and we'll switch to GA. Look at the train. Oh, that's beautiful. Texture right here. Uh, in the meantime, we can also mount our gear. Let me play some tunes. Alright, good. Where's Andy? Oh, there he is. Here's Andy coming in right here. We're gonna watch his landing. We're gonna um, do a replay, guys, as soon as Andy lands. Now uh, we're gonna attach our yoke and stuff to this. And then we're gonna do some RGA flying as Andy comes in. Hold on a sec. Here. All right, good to go up there. Uh, there's Andy. Oh, we gotta get rid of that. Hold on, hold on a second, guys. I gotta attach my yoke. Oh, this bad boy's gotta go mounted, mountain on here. So we could do that, but we're gonna do our replay. Don't worry. Give me a sec. All right, stick it in GF. Yep, stick it in X Men for GA Digital Merc. Yeah, because I want to showcase this Orbic scenery. That's the the point of it. I want to see this Orbic scenery here. For it, that's what we want to see. Yeah, we want to see the Orbic scenery um, for the 
the scare board and stuff. But you guys can find the thing there. Don't drag the replay. Alright, Zadok, we won't drag it. We won't drag it at all. Alright. Let's watch Andy come in here. Don't worry, Andy. Only 100 people watching. Let's go. Yeah, that's beautiful. Here he goes. Oh, that looks like water. Water. Oh, he got it. That was an absolute butter on the Phoenix. Great one, Andy. Great, 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 great. All right, let's go look at our... Um, let's go look at our landing rate and so forth and so on. All right, so... First thing, we are deboarding. 96% passenger satisfaction, that's good. Uh, passengers happy getting off the airplane. Let's go menu and flight. 127 on the landing. This is a 127. I'll save that. Good to go. Let's close you. Let's go to Simple Kid Pro. Says a 192. I don't know. Simple Kid Pro. What are you looking at? We all good there. We got that. So let's quit you. Uh, we're gonna disconnect from that sim, and we're gonna run our replay mode. You guys ready for that? Let me turn down the outside volume here. Because it's going to be loud. Let's go plug in. Toggle replay mode. Where are you? All right. And we're going to go replay. There we go. All right. It's running back. Good to go. We'll watch out till it comes back and see what it looks like. It's going to be good. Then we're going to load up in the Cessna 172 here. Do I have to make radio calls now since we have ground on? Oh, Lord. We're going to have to make radio calls, etc., etc., etc. But we're going to fly VFR, so it shouldn't be too bad. Come on, you can go faster than that. It's loading, guys. It's loading, I promise. Can we drag this? Can we just drag this? Are we going to run into problems if we don't drag it at all? It's not going fast enough. So it does what? Uh, what is your view on which trip set will be more popular on the release? Um, PMDG is going to be popular because it's uh, Microsoft's got 80% on the market. But Flight Factor is going to be great as well, Stefan. So I don't think it's a competition, to be honest. You know, um, X-Plane is um, only, what, 18% on the market? Flight Factor, uh, Microsoft is 80% on the market? Good luck dragging. It's too slow. How long have we been sitting here? A couple of minutes? All right, let's go. All right, here we go. That works. So the trick is to drag it for a little bit first. I right, do the replay first, let it load up, and then you could drag it. That is the trick. All right, here we go. All right, here we go. Let's do a shift five from the tower. Let's watch our... What the heck is that? Why does my tower view suck? Shift 5. Alright, there we go. Oh, it put me inside the tower. Hold on a sec. Let me pause that. We're going to do Shift 2. And we're going to go to the actual tower down here. I see what happens. Puts me in the tower. Only drag a little bit at a time. Yes, you're right, man. So, this is Microsoft for a second. Ah, explain, bro. All right, we're going to stay on top of... Ooh, the tower is modeled. Look at that. Wow. Okay. So the tower is modeled. And we can watch it from the tower. Nah, it's fine. We'll go outside the tower. Here we go. And run you. Here we go. Let's watch our landing. See what she looks like. Good to go. Yeah, I hope I don't take too long as well. Step on. I hope so. Here we go. All right, let's watch this. Let's see how she looks. There it is. Arrest the descent. And... Oh, 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 man. Oh, man. Oh, man. Bruh. Look at the reverse thrust on the IAEs. Hold on. Let's run that back. Run that back. Let's go. Look at this. The control that you have, man, with the sim, that's what makes it special. The control you have right there get the wheels down 
nose come down a little too quick, but got that right. That's beautiful. That's nice. All right, let's go closer to the ground and grab it from there. Let's go you. Let's watch it from this angle right here. Yep, all right, from here. Let's go. Here we go. Get her down. Get her down. Get her down. Mm -hmm. Here we go. Arrest Blair. <laughs> As I said, I always celebrate my good landings because my bad late landing is terrible. Man. Oh, yes. Yeah, this is where X Plane excels because you can see the weight of the airplane. That's when you, you know, you get that ground effect and that, that gross weight. Who was worried about my overweight landing? Who was it that was worried about my overweight landing? Sheesh. Look at that. Fire. Pressure is good. Get set. Shift three. All right. Let's see if we got the center line. We might have been a little bit off the center line. We'll see. Yes, yes! That's how planes are meant to be flown, not floating the entire runway. <laughs> Shots fired. That sound, though. Yeah, we're off to the left a bit. No, actually. We put her down nice. That's pretty much a little off to the left of the center here. That's screenshot worthy. Yeah, I agree. All right. A couple more replays. We're going to do a wing view. And this is the Orbix wing view coming in right here. That's the Orbix scenery coming in for the wing view. Look at that, man. If you weren't overweight, you would have floated. <laughs> true, Rick Henty. True, 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 man. Do a 7 next time we'll fly to Microsoft? Yeah, when the PMDG drops, bro. When the PMDG drops, we'll do the Trooper 7. We'll definitely do it. Nice. Indeed stuff let's go oh look at that wing flexed bruh and the reverses come out so smooth so smooth nice okay, watch it from this side here best landing I've ever seen you done thank you man appreciate the compliment it's the best one I've done in a while I usually don't do great landings, but yeah, we'll take that. Thanks, sir. Appreciate it. All right, after a couple more replays, guys, we're going to load up the Cessna 172 here. Now we're going to go look at the Orbix uh, Earth Great right Bitten North and see what it looks like a little further down low. Let's we'll do that. Here we go. Rivers. Thank you, G Vaz. Appreciate it, sir. With the PMDG, uh, I feel if they're coming within the next two months is not true. I feel like they will release earlier surprising. I think so too. I feel the PMDG is maybe like two weeks away, personally. Maybe that's my, my personal feelings getting in the way here. But I think PMDG is like two weeks away. So. Santiago, what's up, sir? Welcome aboard. Yeah, I want to say PMD is just two weeks away, man. That's me wishful thinking, but hey. Alright, here we go. I'm pretty sure it's still being updated for 2024, perhaps. Good to go. Alright, guys, one more, then we'll load up and go into Cessna 172. Something I have not done in forever. Spawn uh, Zebo 737 please. Zebo doesn't have a 739, man. Fortunately, it doesn't have a 739 at all. Zebo have a 738. No, they have. Does it include areas such as Manchester, Newcastle, Liverpool? 
Um, so that is this is the north version. There's going to be a central and a south version that will include the entire UK. So, um, Conor, this is just the north version. Not including those areas yet. Those areas are coming. This is just the initial release of the Nuggets. So if I remember from the last time we did this, it was um, the last time they did this, they, they released the north first, then central, then south. So those are coming. Um, All right. All right, guys. Time to go ahead and load up back in the sim. Grab the Cessna 172. Look at that. All right, let's go, you. We're going to go kill the replay mode. That's fine. There is our true earth looking good. Let's go, you. Dude, I haven't flown a Cessna, a Skyhawk. Let's go. Basic. And um, EGPH, let's change where are we where are we lining up from in a Cessna. That is there. Is there like a GA ramp somewhere? Is there a G? No, no, no. Is there a GA ramp? No, wrong, wrong airport. Uh, that's Inverness. We want to go EGPH, Edinburgh. Where is the GA ramp for this stuff? Uh, I don't know which one. Z04. Let's load up the Cessna right there and go. Let me back the time up a bit. It's good. And let's start that up. Let's go. See what we look like. Will it be Vatim? Yes, Zada. We're going to do Vatim. Uh, we're going to be with radio traffic and stuff, but it's what it is. Give me a second, guys. We'll be right back. Did I just load up the same airplane? I sure did. But let's go ahead and change airplane. I thought that's what I loaded up. There we go. Um, good. Yeah, I loaded up the wrong airplane. Let's go. Let's try one more time. And we are still in the Airbus, I know, man. We know when the, the, the Triple Seven is about to release once they place it in their store for 999,000. That's true, man. After Cessna 172, can you spawn the 737, please? Yeah, we can take a look at 737 afterwards. That's no problem. Pushback failure. Aircraft Check. appears to not have any steering All right. gears. Where are we? Ooh, look at this. What the heck? Is XB okay? And there's the stairs. We're like in the wrong place. I don't know where the GA ramp is on this. Where's the GA ramp on this bad boy? I have no idea where GA is. We're just gonna... Is there a GA ramp here? Is there such a thing as a GA ramp? Maybe over here, should we move it? Nah, we're gonna be all right. Let's go. I, 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 let me, let me change this location. I think the ramp is gonna be... Maybe up here. I think so. Start it. Thank you, baby. Appreciate it. See ya. We are doomed. What's up, Skyfall? Yeah, I know. XP's flying a GA, bro. Yeah. <clears throat> Alright. Come on. Let's go. Let's go. We are all doomed. Hmm. Oh, that, I think this is better. This is... Oh, there's freaking gates. There's no GA ramp in this thing. Alright, it's fine. Alright, let's go ahead and kill the music. Clear prop! Master up, master up. Let's go ahead and start it up. Uh, let me connect back. What are we connecting of? November... 372 kilo mic. 372 kilo mic. We are a Cessna. 
172. Connect. Let's go. Yeah, GA in the wild. Oh, we're just going to start this bad boy up. We're not going to. Here we go. Start. Oh, boy. Do I even know how to start a, um, a thingamajig? All right, let's go. Master. Fuel pumps. Um, nav lights. Can come on. That's good. Let's go ahead and start. I give it some gas here and some mixture. I remember how to do this. Dude, do you know how long it's been? Oh, it's working. It's working. It's working. No way, man. I'm going to follow your lead as I'm not flowing a GA in England. All right. Uh, ground was what? Uh, ground was 121.75. Yeah. Start up the avionics too as well. Avionics. One or two can come on. Is our push to talk working? Uh, that works. That works. Good. Uh, file a flight plan. Um, we're doing GA flying. Do we have to file a flight plan for GA? Shows you how much I remember. Do we have to file a flight plan for GA? That's my question. It shows you how much I remember about flying GA. Do we? And how do you file a flight plan? Uh, radio. Squawk. Oh god. Yeah, I completely forgot. That's 121.75. That's good. It's a VFR. It's a VFR flying. Um... Let me just give me a second here, guys. I need to check my push to talk on my Now, for 372 kilo, I think you're on holding push to talk long enough. If you could just uh, try repeating. Uh, 372 kilo, mic uh, radio check. Uh, 372 radio mic, uh, kilo mic radio check. Uh, November 372 kilo mic, thank you very much, readability 5. And question for you, we just wanted to do some GA flying out of here. Do we need to file a flight plan for that? If you could, it will make mine and following controllers life so much easier. If you could, thank you. So just file one for you, is that correct? Uh, yes, yeah, please. Right, thank you very much. How do we uh, flight plan? Hold on a second. And I'm just going to see. November 372, Kilo Mike, VFR, yeah, you can file a flight plan, there it is right here. VFR flying, uh, we are Cessna 172. Uh, Central ground, Channel 7, 8, Box Lock Sierra, uh, it's on stand 16, information, roll me on board. We're and light, to Dublin. no category. Mark 7, What's 8, the Box Lock Sierra, equipment? Edinburgh ground today, Dublin, Gossam 1, Charlie, Squawk 2705. Uh, BFR. Clear Dublin, Gossam 1, Charlie, departure, Squawk 2705, Data error. Oh, what do we need for this thing? If we're flying VFR, what do we need? I don't know what we need. Slant Lima. Uh, departure is... Uh, what was the tower? What was this again? EG... Tower on 118.705. Goodbye. So, EGPH to EGPH, uh, we're going to go 5,000 feet, if that much, your speed of 150. And for ground, Golf Mike, Indian, November, Bravo. Golf Mike, Indian, November, Bravo, Edinburgh, ground, hello, Kashi, message. EGPH. I've done this in a while. Golf Mike, Indian, November, Bravo, it's information. Off block time and all that good Mark stuff. Indian Are you kidding? Roger, oh my word. Approved, We're in trouble, guys. We even know how to file a VFR flight. IKO code is circuits, slant golf or slant alpha. Mike, Indian, Roger, 
Slant, golf, slant, alpha. Alright, hold on a second, take a look at this. Slant, golf, slant, alpha. Slant, alpha. Hold. So we're just missing uh, 30 minutes. Windows is one hour. And uh, off block time is uh, 1640. 1640. Golf Mike in Geneva and Bravo, in the ground. Ground, golf, Mike, it must be alphanumeric, so time entered for the character, character. Yeah, so you must be for the character. Give me a second here. Uh, Roger, golf, time for the Bravo, will do. Zero, zero, and uh... Ground, hello, uh, slam one, site 15, of GFR on... Give me a second, guys, I'm just uh, going through the filing press here. Alphanumeric on the data. Uh, what am I missing here, guys? It says equipment must be entered alphanumeric. So call sign VFR Cessna 172, lightweight, slat alpha. What's my equipment here? Uh, what are we missing on the equipment? I don't know. That's a transponder. I don't know. Skip is FAA. Let me try it one more time. Hold on. Yeah, it says uh, equipment must be alphanumeric. What equipment? What is he talking about? Anybody knows? Equipment. It's slant golf. Okay. Simbrief will do VFR. Oh, use Simbrief. Use Skyhawk instead of November. Where do you have a, say, November in the UK? I don't know. Jump in, in a layer and depart from Glasgow back to Inverness. You'll see more of the countryside. Now, I want to check downtown. Lord. All right, check the score for a template. Yeah, this is going to be impromptu. Slam 1, Edinburgh Grounds. Okay, the engine stock of this approved. Stand by while I get your clearance. All right, let me go. Sorry, Thank you, Slam 1. All right, let's see. Where did you send the template to? You have GPS, you are Slack Golf. Okay. Which I don't plan to use my GPS. So we're slant golf. Thank you very much. Just do that. Doo -doo -doo. And then we're ground Shamrock 7 8 Boxer Sierra, stand 1 6, ready, push and start. Yeah, the only thing I'm having a problem with is the equipment. Start face north for Shamrock 7 Alright, there we go. We're filed. I got it. We're filed. We are filed, ladies and gentlemen. We're good to go. Flat plan is filed. And uh, we just request taxi and stuff, and we're gonna be good. I think we're gonna be okay. That's it. Yep, I'm doing a GA, man. <laughs> I'm doing a GA. Uh, we're gonna request our taxi here. And number 372 Kilo Mike, uh, requesting a VFR clearance. Number 372 Kilo Mike, Rogers, standby clearance. Uh, Alright, All right, cool. Alright, let's go. We are good. We are good. Let's go. This is this is gonna be. Number three seven two kilo mic. Just confirm it's gonna be VFR circuits. Yes, VFR circuits. Three seven two kilo. Let me change my um, thing here. I'll change. Number three seven two kilo mic. Just to confirm, I did give you a stock. I know. I didn't get a squat code. Three seven two kilo mic. Excellent. Uh, just gonna be second. I want the other cam. I was going to leave the other cam out. Right. Focus on Mike or Golf. Just facing north, Oscar. Just facing north, Oscar. Let's go ahead and release this box for now. All right, we're doing this, aren't we? Spinner around here. Thank you, and uh, Comanche Six One Papa, looking uh, VFR flight following two and thirteen. Let's spin her around. Number 2361 Papa, Roger. Just confirm your VFR. I'm um, your yeah, correction, it's in, in Don't hit the bins, bro. Don't hit the bins. Don't hit the bins. Yeah, Roger, you filed an IFR flight plan, so just your VFR. Oh, yeah, sorry about that. Three months, let's get started. Correct. November 2361, Papa. We just need a squall code, and we're going to be good to go. Alright, cool. We didn't hit the bins. 
Let's see, yeah, we're far from it. This is ought to, this ought to be fun. <laughs> what did you walk into the aviator? I know, man. What did you walk into, bro? We are flying a GA airplane. Let's go. Yeah, we have the flight plan locked already, but we are trying to set it up for um, the VFR. Uh, six one Two, three, six one Yeah, change it to the FR on my standby while I get your clearance. Uh, it's quite a deal. Go here. Alright, so here we are. And we're gonna take off... To... We're gonna take off to the... South, and we're gonna keep the Speedbot 1448, stand 5, type AC20, request clearance. Wait, we shall see. Let's go. Maybe this will work. Maybe this won't work. I don't know. I just want to go take off already. Our uh, mixture is rich. Got some lights on. Load into the F-15 formation. No Ryanair 2969 ready for push on start. Uh, yeah, I do need lights. I do need lights. Let's go. Face north, Strips on, the heat on, taxi on, nabs on, on, beacon, uh, we don't need to yet, we're not on runway. Plan 1, clear to leave the Let's Edinburgh get. control zone to the north via the Kelty Bay and VLP, not yeah, above yeah. altitude 2,000 feet DFR. Alright, there we go. Zero, four, four, I didn't one. even check to see how much fuel we have on board this thing. Which the first one was out of departure. Clear to leave the Edinburgh control zone to the north via the Kelty Lane and VLP. What is what's VFR squawk code well, in uh, in England, guys? What's the VFR squawk code here? I don't know. If you're going to be wanting radar vectors, it's going to have to be a whole new IFR flight plan. So if you're going to be doing that, so if you find an IFR flight plan, can we please? Um. I don't remember how you use G1000 either. G750. Little station standby one, I've accidentally just disconnected. There's a range on this thing. That's a flight plan. I, I haven't looked at one of these in so many. Uh, 7,000 is a squawk code. Alright, cool. So, here's a 7,000. We're going to squawk on. There you go. That's on. At least I know how to do that. Uh, ring range. There we go. There it is. Beans. We are, and um, right thank you, Evan. Right near 2969, uh, pushback will be delayed, just a couple of minutes, sorry, we're Is this a non-movement area? Hold on. Yeah, that's fine. Yes, yes, flying with Cheetos, what's going on, brother? Happy Saturday to you, man, we're just going to be doing some flying today, man. Ten months, flying with Cheetos, thank you, bro, appreciate it. Welcome, welcome, welcome aboard. How you doing? Thanks for the continued support. That is good. We'll probably shut down here. We're gonna burn up some um, All stations that were calling for VFR. Um, November 372 Kilimac. Were you calling for VFR clearance? Ah, uh, roger that. We're just gonna be uh, doing a low VFR um, outside of the um, airspace here. Roger, leaving video north, south, east, or west. And we're going to be uh, leaving to the. Give me a second. Give me a second. Uh, what are we leaving to? Mike, Indian November Bravo. Sorry, were you requesting VFR as well? Uh, Roger, the entire circuit. Go for November Bravo. November Bravo, thank you very much. Yeah, all VFR standby one. Yeah, my control car just crashed. All right, so we're going to leave it to the. Uh, where are we going? Off to my left wing. So yeah, we're gonna leave to the uh, east. VFR to the east. Can we go in downtown? VFR to the east. That's it. <clears throat> yeah, we got full ATC. Yeah. 
Altitude is mode C and standby RA Beijing. What's left VAC and voltage? We have an issue here right now. I think we're good. Oh, flap. Almost forgot. Almost forgot takeoff flaps. Ground, November 739, Hotel Sarah, ready to pick up. VFR clearance, we will be departing to the east. It's odd seeing in the, me in this plane. Oh, and I know, man. I know. Yeah, you should be back on here shortly. November 739, Hotel Sierra, Roger. You're going to be number four. Roger. And uh, 372 Kilo Mike, we're going to be VFR to the east as well. 17 kilo, thank you so much. Alright, cool. Alright, we'll go away once we increase the throttle. Golf Mike, India, November Bravo, currents are ready. Good to go. Uh, go ahead, Golf, November Bravo. Golf Mike, India, November Bravo, uh, hold position after departure, cleared air runway there people, is. cleared right hand visual circuit. Not above altitude 1500 feet VFR on the Edinburgh QNH 1000, Squawk 7010. Departure 24 right hand circuit, start above 1500 or get around GNH 1000, squawking 07010, Golf November Bravo. Golf November Bravo, just confirm squawk 7010. Yeah, I'm just waiting for clearance of taxi. Squawk 7010, Golf November Bravo. Clavo 41 is fine, sir. Welcome aboard. And then we're ground, Shamrock 78, Fox Shot Sierra, ready taxi. Fox 78, Fox Shot Sierra, taxi 1.0 to 1, runway 24 via Golf Mike Alpha and Delta. Hold my down to one runway two four by golf my alpha and down dash on my seven box with you. That's easy enough. Maybe XP will finally want to to the ATR after this another <laughs> stream. I don't know, we'll see it, man. Is this the start of XP 2.0 GA version? <laughs> Perhaps. Man, oh man, let's go! Let me rock my wings here, make sure that those will work. Yep, they work. Here it is, right here. Those work. Alright, good. Wings work. Work perfectly. Good to go. Alright, we're just burning fuel. We just risk, risk. Oh, <laughs> Dougal McTavish. Just got on Dougal. Good evening, brother. Yeah, don't don't scratch your eyes, Dougal. You are actually seeing me in a GA airplane in a Cessna 172, <laughs> flying. I want to do some sightseeing around Edinburgh. Edinburgh. That's it. I just want to do it, man. DC six and DC three incoming. I don't know. We'll see. Man, oh man. I just want to taxi around. Did you just sneeze? Let's go. Come on. Yeah, we have half time to Let's see where we are. Okay, taxi in my alpha and the hold of alpha one two and expect one bravo to put on. Fox 78 Foxtrot Sierra contact Edinburgh approach 121 decimal 205. Bye bye. 121205. Oh, you did Edinburgh and that's the last I did? Nice, nice. And uh, November 372 Kilo Mike. Just want to do VFR to the east. That's it, really. No circuits. Yeah, that's fine. I'm just getting your phone snapping me on sec. Roger, thanks. Alright, cool. So, Sierra um, to Mike. Papa, we can move on an unmoving area, right? I think we should be able to move. Let's go and see if the aircraft. Ryanair 2969 ready for taxi. It does move. Ryanair 2969, taxi on point Delta 1, runway 24 via Echo, Foxtrot, Alpha, and Delta. We can move. We can move. This is my first time flying Geo on stream? Taxi yeah, holding first time in about, one, two, four, five, in about Echo, five Foxtrot, years. Foxtrot, Alpha, and Delta, Ryanair 2969. First time in about five years, man. True. November Bravo, ready taxi. Golf 
November Bravo, Roger. Uh, would you like Charlie one or are you okay with Delta one? Oh, whatever, it's just most convenient for you. Yeah, we haven't done GA flying in like at least four or five years. We used to do GA group flights back in the day. We didn't get around long enough. Yeah, we haven't done a GA group flight in a long time. Okay, just hold position. There's currently an aircraft that's about to taxi through there. Just expect about a couple minutes to delay. No problem. Thank you. Last time was probably with sim wings, exactly, Dougal. Remember sim wings? Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Yeah, it's been a while. It's been a while, man. Last time we crashed in the Grand Canyon. Zada, remember that? It's true. Hello, Maguan, hello, Renner 5-4, Bravo. Alright, let's go now with the players here. Renner 5-4, Bravo, Quebec, Edinburgh, Grand Canyon. Taxi Alpha, hold Alpha 1-2. Expect stand 1-2. Copy that, Renner 5-4, Stand one seven way and five uh, four This is where if uh, X Plane had a multiplayer platform, it would be nice to get a multiplayer and do this and not have to bother ATC, you know. Uh, especially on a, a big airport like this. This is where a multiplayer would have been nice. There's somebody else taxiing over here. Yeah, not a Cessna. Yeah, this is where it would have been nice. If x had a multiplayer platform that we could use, we'd be good men. United 748, perhaps, when? That's blinding me. Perhaps. The station's Edinburgh, broadcast new QNH 1001, Edinburgh out. And then 2969, contact Edinburgh approach 121.205, bye bye. One zero zero. In my approach on 121.205, thanks for seeing I've got this shit day. Bye bye, Ryan. You're 2969. Alright, that's 1001. Good to go. GS struggles are real. They get put in the back of the line at the big airports. Yeah, Andy, that's true. I'd be back in X Plane if they had multiplayer. Yeah, you know what? Google, I'm going to ask about that. Why can't they make a multiplayer platform? Like, seriously. Multiplayer and X Plane would be. Actually, be legit. It would be good. I just thought about Easy it. One, zero, five, you don't want to get on Vatican, but you want to fly with your Easy friends. One, zero, five, it would be nice, and right now you can't do that on X Plane, can you? Yeah. If X Plane had a multiplayer platform, it would be good. Definitely would be good. F54 Bravo Q, continue taxi stand 17 via Alpha, Lima, Golf. Continue just under one seven yell fully mine confirm and five four bow. Some check comments here. Oh crap, no wonder. Look at this. Nordic two four one kilo start one five requesting my front turns to EMBR. The UK is covered at DC, but we're all we have no information on it. We're at Edinburgh. Two five one kilo. Nineteen arrivals and twenty departures. That's why. Maybe we load up we loaded up at the wrong airport. We should have loaded up somewhere else. Emigrant, um, hello, shuttle in uniform, uh alpha two. Alpha right one there, trying to clip my wings. Yeah. Did realize it would take this long. I'm currently in a GA group flight with uh, Alice and Johnson. Are you? Uh, awesome, dude. Awesome, awesome, awesome man. You Emigrant, can join hello, FS? What's join FS Aviation Geek two sixty eight? Join FS. Yeah, look into that. Hmm. People probably would think it's bad or unrace for X Plane. Evan, just having fun with your friends. It's I nice. Girl, it is nice. Man. I think he gave you the wrong altimeter settings. The altimeter showing you may be below the altimeter. Taxi Alpha, Echo, yeah. Foxtrot, Stand yeah. 10. That's what he Echo, said, Foxtrot, though, so I don't know. Golf Mike India November Bravo continue taxi on point Charlie 1 runway 24 via Mike Alpha and Charlie. Charlie 1 via Mike Alpha Charlie, Golf November Bravo. Hey, very good afternoon, easy. Yeah, one line to the end. All you need is model matching CSL for X-Men. Yeah, that's it. Renefest is a multiplayer provider for all flight sims and they are cross play. Oh, interesting, didn't know that. You get awesome blue experience in asking. 
John F.S. is sadly still pretty bad, he's bigger. Man. Alright. Um. Thank you, Zato. I don't want to disconnect from Vatim because I like the immersion, but should we disconnect from Vatim and just. Yeah. The question is should we fly offline just to do the GA flight or should we wait? I had 372 kilomite. Alright, here we go. Uh, one two one uh, two zero five. Apologies, Scott. Hello, Bravo. Number three seven two kilo Mike. Clear to leave the Edinburgh control zone to the east. So the Dell P to VRP. Not above altitude two thousand feet. VFR on the QNH one zero zero one. Scott zero four three one. Three seven two kilo Mike. Roger. Just confirm. Clear to leave the control zone via the Dell P to VRP. Uh, clear the control zone, Dalkey, VRP, uh, 372 kilomite, Squawk 0431. 372 kilomite, thank you very much. Delta is approved, report ready for taxi. Oh, we are ready for taxi, kilomite. Cool. Alright, let's go. November 372 kilomite, thank you very much. Taxi, Sierra, Mike, hold Mike 1. Sierra, Mike, hold Mike 1, you know, uh, kilomite. I got to stop saying. <laughs> I'm gonna have to stop saying. Um, 2806. All right, straight ahead, right turn on Mike. Hold short, Mike one. Straight ahead, right turn on Mike. Hold short, Mike one. All right, we're good to go. Let's go. Yeah. Zato, you heading to bed? You tired? I got you, man. Uh, right turn here. We're gonna hold short, Mike one down there. That's it, dude. We're taxiing a G8. I can take Space 350 and I'll need to give it one to Yo, Luis, Del Gras. Thank you, Luis. Thank you, sir. That's Mike. Everything is so much slower and lower to the ground. Alright, so here's my taxi. We're going to hold short Mike. Captured Bergen at 5 on the Greece 3 Charlotte Parchers, walk 0556. Alright, so we got nothing off to our left here, we go about right turn on Mike, past the big jets. Dude, you can't see nothing on the ground, it's so low. I'm, I'm gonna have to bone up on my GA skills now. Like radio calls and stuff. I have no four, idea how to do it. At all. Thank you, Lewis. Dalgras. Thank you, sir. Appreciate it. Hold off one by Ryan and six for the turn there. Love the textures here, though. All right, controls are free and clear. We are good to go. And we're gonna go hold short up my hand down here. Let's go. Since getting back into that sim, seeing you guys stream while also flying on a network fills me with admiration. <laughs> yeah, you know, once you step away for a minute, you have to come back to it, man. It, it's something else, but without it, Dougal, you, it, with that sim, your flights are just enjoyable. Look above altitude 2,000 feet VFR on the end of a Alright, let me just see something uh, here. 1001, the Delkey 3RP, the man says. Uh, let's go departure. Uh, um, Squawk 0443, I think. 739 Hotel Sierra. What's the Delkey 3RP, guys? Um, it's a dumb question. Delkey 3RP, not above altitude 2,000 feet VFR on the end of yeah, what's a Del Key 3RP? Uh, I'm sure. missing that. Uh, via the Delta VRP, QNH is 1001, 739 Hotel Sierra. 39 Hotel Sierra, uh, I'll send you in text. Yeah, Del Key 3RP, I'm curious to know what that is. It, uh, it's a SID, out of here, probably just a vector SID. Let's go hold short of Mike 1. Here's Ryanair over there. 
What's going on, Amtrak fan? Welcome aboard, man. My visual field of view right now is probably in the 70 to 75 range. Um, I could do more, but I, I kind of like it close to the instrument panel. I don't have to see the entire cockpit because I have the head movement. I want to say like 7 75. We'll see. So my visual field of view is um, really not um, wide at all. Alright, so mic one should be this one coming up right here. Uh, let's double check that. Let's go out of time. Alright, mic one. And then we'll probably get a right turn on pop and go up. Let's go. Visual reporting point. Ah, Simscott. Okay. I got my so, uh, is there a reference to chart to to for visual reporting uh, point? Not above 2,000 feet. QNH Interesting. Visual RP. Interesting. See, I'm learning, man. So you have to leave the, via the circuit and head for that. I'm ready to get right, to the Logic, can you just I'm right here. This oh, there you go. Uh, uh, taxi, All right. Thank you, thank you, thank you very much, uh, Scott. Appreciate that. Uh, so since back, we're going to be Mike going to the east, I'm just going to make the left turn and head out there. Uh, As you're flying my local airport, Inverness, love flying, flying that route. Andy, 70D, thank you, sir. Checking in. Let's go for the local, Number 372, Kilo Mike, Alpha, hold Alpha 16. Just alpha, hold alpha one six, kilo mic. Let's go. All right, alpha, alpha one. Is that what he says? Yeah. Wait a minute. What runway are we using? We're using runway two four. Is that correct? Hold on a second. Are we using runway 6 out of here? He said Alpha 1. Next left, Alpha, Alpha 1. Is that what he just said? Am I missing that, guys? Confirm that for me. And uh, 372 kilobyte, that was next left, Alpha, hold short, Alpha 1. Hold short, Alpha 1, 6. Alpha 1, 6. Come on, thanks. Alright, that's 1, 7. 1, 6 should be up here, I was going to say. Alright, Alpha 1, 6 is going to be... Edmund Ground, Golf Tango, Romeo, Mike Lehman, Zodiamond 42, GA, Golf Tango, Romeo, Mike Lehman, Zodiamond 41, request start, VFR, departure, west. Golf Tango, Romeo, Mike Lehman, standby. No, it's left and hold front. Getting it wrong here. I'm holding front, one sec. There he goes, on the takeoff row. This is all new to me, man. This is all new. New, 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 new to me. goes. Is he off? Tail strike. Not getting it off the ground. Oh, crosswind got him. He's not getting off the ground. Finally. Bruh. Nice. Alright, we're going to try out for 1-6. Is this one right here. Here we go. He's got Good to go, man. Defender 370, Kilo Mike. Continue taxi holding point Charlie 1, runway 245 Charlie. So you think we're gonna take off from which which point? We're gonna take off from Charlie One. Ah, that's what it is. So that's that's where Alpha One Six is. So okay, I got you. I see. Makes sense. Defender three seventy Kilo Mike, continue taxi holding point Charlie One runway two four five Charlie. Uh, continue taxi Charlie One hold short uh four five Charlie next to Kilo Mike. I got you. Yeah, I gotta um, make sure that I remember my call sign. Yeah, I have to make sure that I remember my call sign. That's what it is, I gotta remember. Yeah, Google, I am not flying real world weather because I just wanted to make sure that we could see some scenery today. On this morning. 121.275. Uh, and Hotel Sierra contact. Here we go. Hold short. We're gonna hold short here. Well, 
Alright, so takeoff flap is good. All that stuff is good. And November 372 kilo make sure I for Is that what he said? Yeah. Double check. One. Twenty-one two zero five. Ah, two zero oh, five. Golf, Tango, Rabia, Mike Lima, and a parade. Ah, hello. Extraction of a ground. One seven nine seven. Report your aircraft flight and stand to the police. Set in the catcher. Air Diamond Forty. There we go. And November three seven two kilo Mike holding short two four at uh, Charlie. It's 121205. 121205. Oh, can we get 05 on this? Go fight Lima, Roger. Thank you. Uh, stand by. I'll call you back. If you want one, Julia, head that way, bro. Thank you. I'm in it. 205. Can we get 205? Uh, one, nine, two, nine, I'll uh, read about the uh, three. I didn't understand that second. Uh, if you want one, Julia, head that way. There we go. 205. Oh, clear to show. Hi, that's right. Hi, perfect. Hey, Oliver, what's going on, sir? Welcome. Hey, Kia, this is welcome. Hey, Radars, November 739, Hot Sauce Sierra, Point Charlie 1, number 2. November 739, Hot Sauce Sierra, Edinburgh Radar. Hello, hold at Charlie 1 and report ready for departure. I'm ready for departure, 739, Hot Sauce Sierra. November Hotel Sierra, thank you. Just confirm your um, after departure instructions. Is it by Del Keith? Uh, yeah, only issue is I can't find a chart or anything on. November Hotel Sierra, Roger. Uh, it looks to be around uh, 10 miles to the southeast of Edinburgh. Okay, just to confirm, is that a VOR 739 Hotel Sierra? Roger, no, Del Keith is a VRP, not a VOR, so, um, I don't know, if you have the Sky Demon or something like that, you should be able to find it. Um, alternatively, I could try to find a chart if that helps. Uh, just give me one second to let me look. And number 372 Kilo Mike, ready to go, runway 24. November 372 Kilo Mike, Edibit Radar. Hello, traffic information is a Puffer PA24, currently right downwind, runway 24, report in sight. And got the traffic inside. November, Kilo Mike, thank you, via Charlie 1, surface winds 290 at zero degrees at 9 knots, runway 24, clear for takeoff with a left hand turn out. Uh, clear for takeoff, runway 24, um, Kilo Mike. November, Bra, right, cool. Golf Let's November, go. Bravo, Here traffic it is. information is a Cessna 172, currently departing runway 24. Alright guys, let's go see if we have November one that takes Bravo, the flight. You, they be I have shortly. not report flown a GA plane in a years. Uh, report final, but Roger, let's Bravo. go. Nothing, nothing, nothing. All the lights are on. Flat control check is good. Departure. Let's see if we can do this. November Hotel Sierra, Roger, hold it. Charlie 1, let's just got go, another aircraft go. before we're to touch and go. I'll call you back shortly. <clears throat> Roger, hold it. Charlie 1, set 9 Hotel Sierra. Alright, let's go. Full power. Alright, let's get the, um, that door, man, that's twisting out to the uh, left side from that single in from here. It's all good. Here's me for life. 60 knots. We should be able to take off at that speed. We're assessing it. Yep, here we go. Yes. It's coming back. Oh, it's coming back. It's coming back. Watch our departure okay, speed. Look at that. We are so fast now. Ridiculous. <laughs> uh, hold that runway heading there. Stay below 2,000 feet, sir. And you're going to be okay. Kilo Mike, route and route report overhead the Delta CRP. We'll report Delta CRP. The Bedbow Hotel Zero behind the uh, Papa PA24 before we touch and go via Charlie 1, flying right, up from 824 behind. Alright. Uh, uh, can you repeat that? Wow. Uh, Alright. The Bedbow Hotel Zero, Correction Hotel Zero, via Charlie 1, flying up from 824, the aircraft should pass by now. We can watch our uh, speed. Uh, 924, 924, 924, 924, 924, 924, 924, 924, 924, 924, 924, 924, 924, 924, 924, 924, 924, 924, 924, 924, 924, 924, 924, 924, 924,
nose down trim, nose down trim. Man, oh man. Very good, guys. Look at that, look at that. That's pretty cool. Perfect for the win. Did a great job here. Alright, so climb out is good. About 500 feet a minute, something around there. It's fine. Jeez, these things are so good. kilo mic for your parting altitude. Uh, two kilo mic, we are uh, 800 feet. Roger, currently indicating 1,100 feet. Just check the pressure setting there, 1001. Check to 1001. Uh, The Hotel Sierra traffic information is a Papa PA24, currently right downwind from a 24, and a Cessna 172, currently right, around two miles to the south of the Aerodrome report. Hey, I'll have the paper inside where I do see the Cessna intake. Yeah, Cessna intake, Hotel Sierra. Lepa Hotel Sierra, thank you. Side between 290 degrees at 9 knots from a 24, clear for takeoff with a left hand turn now. Let's go, let's go. And two kilo mic uh, with a request. November kilo mic posh message. And can we do um, VFR to the north east? November kilo mic, Roger, are you familiar with the Kelty Lane? Uh, not familiar with the Kelty Lane. November Kilo Mike Roger, you're clear to leave the edible control zone via the Kelty VRP, not above altitude 2,000 feet in VFR, and uh, Squawk remains 0431, the Chin H1001. 1001 over 31 at above 2,000 feet. Uh, I believe uh, we're going to help me. Kill me. Yeah. Alright, here we go. We're going to go. Make a left turn at above 2,000 November Bravo. Ah, damn, that's what November it Bravo. Two nine zero degrees at nine knots from a two four. Clear the ramp. Speed's good. Five hundred feet a minute. Man, we're getting tossed around here. November Kilo Mike, route back towards the field and uh, report overhead. We'll route back towards the field. Report overhead. Uh, to the Mike, thank you. November Kilo Mike, apologies. Route towards the field and report inside. I will route back towards the field. Report inside. November Hotel Sierra, just caution that um, Cessna 172 ahead is just going to return to the field. Right. Just be uh, yeah, just be wary of those. Hey, we're at Jay Town 39 Hotel Sierra. And two kilo mic that field one side. November kilo mic, thank you. Above and behind the pop at PA24 landing runway 24. You're cleared to cross the 24 threshold, not to below altitude 1000 feet. And the QNH is 1001. Report overhead. Uh, cleared across the 24 threshold, not below 1000 feet. Let's go ahead and get some nose down for him. Stay above 1,000, and says, and below 2. We're going to be alright. Here we go. So we're heading for the 2 4 thresholds, and we're going to go there. Chase, what a map was in by fire we're doing today. GA flying with ATC. That is crazy. Absolutely. Nuts. Are you still planning to route towards Delkey? Alright, I think I'm going to have to return to the airport. I'm running problem with my altimeter, and Hotel Sierra. November Hotel Sierra, Roger, join and report left downwind from a 24. Uh, join and report left downwind from a 24, and Hotel Sierra. Ah, there we go. Cool. A little bit more nose down trim here. There's 24 threshold, we're going to cross it, report overhead. Uh, Golf 11 Bravo, do you want us back checking to uh, Charlie yeah, or continue on to Bravo? Uh, Golf November Bravo, it's up to you. Uh, there's no other outbound traffic to affect, so you're welcome to backtrack and vacate by Charlie. Uh, Roger, we'll backtrack and vacate okay, Charlie. Golf November Bravo. Right. Yeah, we should be able to hold her out to here. We're going to head to the right, head downtown, do some sightseeing, but that scenery right there is absolutely beautiful. Man. GF flying is a lot more work than IFR flying, I find. Absolutely is. Yeah, do you, uh, GA flying for me is a lot more work. Absolutely a lot more work. And over 2 kilo mic, over 2-4. November kilo mic, thank you. Route towards uh, Kelty, not above altitude 2,000 feet, clear for Towards course, Kelty, not above altitude 2,006. Golf November Bravo, welcome right, back to Edinburgh. Go. Taxi to hold at Charlie 3. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Let's go, Charlie 3, Golf November Bravo. 
Contact ground 121 We're trimmed out. We're holding altitude. That's fine. The aircraft is doing good. Normally you have an iPad with a loving map that shows all the ERPs, etc. I could imagine, bro. That's the beauty of it. But yeah. Nice. I think VA fly GA flying is way more strict in uh, <clears throat> in England and Europe than it is in the US. I think it is. VFR in America, you just request VFR, you stay above or below the class Bravo airspace or Charlie, whatever, and you're good to go. But hey, this is fun. Mad fun. Mad fun. Alright, so here's what I'm going to do. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to disconnect my baton. I'm going to save these controllers the headache of dealing with me. And we're just going to do some sightseeing. There's a couple things down here I want to look at. There's a couple things here. So we, we disconnect from baton. It's all good. Kelly is north of the bridge. to your left. I got you. Yeah, so we did disconnect from baton. I don't want to give these guys too much extra work. They have nothing to do with it. So we're going we're gonna to remain here. Some sightseeing. We're gonna pull the throttle back and we're gonna go down because there's a couple of things that Orbing's put into their sceneries down here that is pretty good. Map should went up anyway. There we go. And we want to go see those. That's what I want to see. Over here. See what Orbing's put into the scenery. This is a showcase for them and me doing GA flying. But imagine if we got the entire world from Orbix looking like this. Honestly, I would, this would be fun. Yeah, I forgot to put my flaps up completely. I didn't have a, a warning uh, instrument on my dash telling me that I didn't have flaps up at all. Outside sounds are too loud. Okay. We go turn down outside sounds on the exterior. I see. Yeah. That's exterior. Hopefully it's better now. There we go. Cool. Anyway, watch our speed. Uh, there's some kind of castle up here or something like that. I don't know what it is. I want to see that. Two Tone Murphy. What's going on, brother? I am uh, in your your neck of the woods uh, in terms of the kind of flying. This is you, man. This is not me at all. I have no idea what I'm doing flying GA, GA planes, Murphy. No idea what I'm doing here. I'm just looking at this poor big scenery going, wow, this thing is good. But I saw some kind of castle off to our right. We're going to do a couple of circles around it, see if we can figure it out. Man, this is, yeah, this, you know, this is not me. Like, what is this? Anybody knows what we're looking at over here, off to our right side? I saw this thing. I don't know. Yeah, what, what is that? Oh, we're stalling it. I heard that, that chirp. I was like, what the hell is that? Yep. What is that thing? What is that, guys? What are we looking at? Don't stall it, bro. Yeah, I don't know what that is, but that is fascinating to me. That's one of the landmarks they have around here. Watch my speed. Watch the speed here. We're going to come back around and go back and look at it. Got to work for the, the wages? Yes, I know. You got to work for the wages on this. Watch out for bird strikes. I hope not. I hope not. Oh, look at that. Wow. That's an old church down there. Alright, there we go, dude. Let's slow it up. Also, here. What is that? These buildings look fantastic. Another old cathedral off to our right side there. Let me go outside for a second. Where is it? Let's stay. Let's stay in the cockpit. I want to go down to the coastline as well and see what they did with the coastline. Watch my speed. Speed is good.
and then we're gonna go down to the bridges to take a look at that. But yeah, they replace a lot of handcrafted things in the scenery, which is pretty cool. I like, I like that. Oh yeah, they did a great job, man. I like playing just going on to welcome board, man. It's like we said, look at that. Yeah. I was in the back seat here, I had my camera out. I want to go down to the coastline. There's a couple things down in the coastline that I want to see. Like that. Can we go down to like, what, um, 500 feet? Yeah, we're about at 500 feet right now. Let's see what this is, some kind of resort or something. Don't know what that is. Looks good. Look at that. Looks like some kind of res like seaside resort or something. It looks like some kind of seaside resort. Maybe. The water looks good too. And the water masking that they did looks absolutely excellent. Dark Wharf area. Yo, Alberto, I know, man. What's going on, Alberto? Yeah, it looks good. Two turn. Two tone. All I want from Orbix now is the entire world looking like this. If they can handcraft the entire world, I think it would be worth the, the download space and a hard drive just to have for all the X Plane users. You know, remember for X Plane. A lot of people don't have PCs, they have Macs, and you can't get Microsoft on a Mac. So this would be good for those, those guys who don't have it. Looks like some kind of um, factory, offloading goods, so forth and so on. Good job. So the way they mix the ortho and stuff is pretty cool with this. Alright, speed's good. We haven't stalled it yet. We haven't crashed out. I thought I saw... Uh, football stadium down here. Soccer pitch. I think so. Yeah, I think I saw a soccer... Yeah. Soccer stadium right here. Right off my right side. Golf course to the left of the course. It's an hour. Of birthplace. Yeah, there it is. Who knows in Edinburgh? What stadium is that? Probably not Premier League, but it looks good. It looks nice. Got a local team or something? That looks good. Nice handcraft. Stadium. Alright, let's go check out the bridges over there. We flew past those buildings already. Let's go check out the bridges. The villages. America's friendly, yes. There, we're speeding now. The village is there, but nowhere this is some kind of cost. Mm. All right, let's go check out the um, watch my calls it over here. We're just Speed away. And see what these look like. Now, what I like that Orbix did is that you can mask the explain roads so that the roads blending better with the scenery. You don't have the roads on top like you usually do with explain where you see them stand out no matter what the weather and time of day is. I like that. Let's go. It's now too rare, a little too low here. Yeah, I like that you, you can mask the road so it blends in more with the ortho, which is pretty cool to do. That I like. Go. Santiago, you want us to load up in a 3.30 after this? After this, we're done, man. I've been at it for a few hours now, brother. Next time, we're going to look at an A330. Absolutely. And what I like though, the, the ortho is not bad down low. You know, you know, it's not bad down low at all. The 
Ortho actually looks decent even in the low. So the GA flying, it's pretty good. They did the mask and water mask good as well. And there's our airport here we will land on the T4. We get back. But yeah, they did the mask good on the water. I love that. Altitude is stable, 500 feet, up to 1,000. But there's that, that, that tri bridge over here. Blood alive. Thank you, brother. Thanks for checking in. Appreciate it, man. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Now we're going to go across the bridge on the uh, left side and then make it back on the right and come back and land. Uh, <laughs> Dougal Tuton Murphy is getting you in trouble with the missus. Of course he is. Oh, look at that. Delta. That's pretty cool. I love how the homes are just nestled in there. Ooh, there's a castle here. Look at that. Side of a hill. Speaking of a hill, it's making sure that we're not going too low. We're going to be okay. Alright, so we're going to go circle around the bridges and come back and land on 2-4. That's it. So there's uh, three bridges here is what I'm seeing. One looks like a train bridge. This looks like a bridge for a train. I could be wrong. Model, very nice. Indeed. Looks like a train bridge, yeah. Wow. Detail on is good. The details. Speed is fine. Yeah, that is model very nice. You don't crash, aren't you? Get yeah, back in a cockpit, sir. Pretty good. What's going on, Millenario? What's up, man? How are you? Welcome aboard. Oh, there's a ship down here. Is that the QE2? No, it's a cargo ship. There's a ship there. So this is the, the roadway. So one train and two roadways, maybe. Or old and new. Why do you have three bridges in the same place? We got traffic on the road. Traffic. Traffic. Descend. Layer off conflict. All right, let's bring her around. Speed's good, altitude's good. I think this brings me back to wanting to maybe do another flight one of these days. Let's see how it goes. All right. Not bought indeed, not bought. Let's see if we can fly through these bridges here. Whoa, 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 bank angle tracks. Bank angle. I'm gonna fly through the middle of these things. Like right here. I can imagine you're a passenger in a Cessna and somebody's doing that with you in there. You would like, yo, the detail on that bridge is legit nice. Not gonna lie. That is legit nice. The detail on the roadway is legit nice as well. Look at that. Come on, man. Jamie, what's going on, sir? Welcome aboard, Jamie. Good evening. Glad to have you in the streaming chat. Guys, that looks good. The details on these are nice. Good job, Warwick. Good job, good job, good job. Alright, let's go find our runway and our airport and let's go. What do we have down here? This is a Tesco. Yep, that's a Tesco. Right on the base of the bridge. And 
there is our runway, so we're going to do like a semi downwind and then right turn base and land. Let's go, let's go. Let's see if we can land a Cessna if we remember how to do that. Yeah. Alright, so here's our runway. We're a little bit on like a downwind flight down in here. We'll keep her out to the, where are we, like 600 feet. I'm going to start pulling her back a little bit and then go land. Alright, so that's us. We're landing right there. Alright, bridges. Let's go. Let's go. Gotta remember our flaps for landing. Be too high. Let's extend this out a bit. Let's move back. Flap one. Start bringing her around. I think we might be too high there. landing gear to go down is there. No. So it might be a little high on you. It's fine. We'll make time. That shouldn't be a problem at all. Speed is good. Let's go. Let's go. Try to butter. Now do it. <clears throat> What's the land speed of this thing? Like what? 50 knots or 60 knots? Fairly high and steep. Yeah, she's not beating off any speed. Let's go full. We are full. Trim it nose down. What does the flaps look like? Oh, look at that. Flaps all the way out. Bro, pay attention. Watch her speed. Alright, the wind's hitting. Keep the speed up. Grab it. Gentlemen, we made it back in one piece. We are alive. We can walk away from this landing. Good to go. No oh, toe brakes, where are you? Easy. There's no beta on this thing, is there? Man, where is the turnoff point? Wanted to keep the speed up, but hey, it's all good, man. Cut the power now. Thank you, Owen. <laughs> Appreciate it. Wow, wow, wow. Yes, sir. We'll do a replay on this landing and we'll call it on that. Absolutely. Guys, fantastic. Fantastic. Shout out to Orbix again. Guys, if you're on X-Plane 11 or 12, go check out Orbix to Earth. It's available for you guys to have now. It is a great scene, as you can tell, both for IFR and GA flying. Just landed back in Inverness. Andy, nice. Hope it is good. I appreciate each and one of you guys in the stream and the chat. Thank you so much for being a part of the experience of this flying that we're doing here. We'll be back on Monday with more flying, more streaming, more stuff. we got some products to showcase as well that's coming up for you guys. So I appreciate each one of you guys in the stream channel. Thank you all the moderators, all the sponsors of the channel. Thank you for all the likes. Thank you for all the loves. Thank you for all the donations. Appreciate you guys being here on another one. I will see you guys again 
baked here. We are out and guys, we gotta go. Let's go, let's go, let's go. See it later, guys. Appreciate it. Bye. Take care. Oh, butter. Let's go back. Look at it. See you guys.